da, da. What's up, everybody? Welcome on in. It's time for us to do some streamy things. Oh, no. Game's bitching at me because my driver's out of date. I can't help that. I can't help that, NVIDIA. I mean, I can't help that, but I don't help that because I'm lazy. What's up, Arthur? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Frodato, good to see you as well. Welcome on in. Fantastic to have everybody. I think today's going to be cool. Uh, we're playing... I've, I got a preview version of Far Cry 5. And so we're going to be checking it out. I think today's going to be super rad. I love Far Cry. Far Cry 3 is awesome. Far Cry 4 is awesome. Far Cry 5 is more than likely going to be awesome. Uh, this is one of the few series that I actually wait for and I get excited about. I'm pretty cynical about most video games nowadays. For some reason, I get excited about Far Cry. I don't know. It's going to be pretty rad. What's up, Ultra Gamer? How you doing, TV guy? Welcome on in. Galaxy, hey, Rom. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Welcome on in. Uh, we'll get started in just a minute, but for now, there's going to be like cinematics and stuff, I bet. And so we're going to hang out and just say hi to everybody for the first five, ten minutes so that during the cinematics, we don't have to like talk or anything like that because pff, who watches a stream for the talking? What's up, Wolf Queen? How you doing? Welcome in. Jay Fart. How's it going? Apparently, these guys decided to attack Montana. That seems like a bad idea to me. They got a lot of guns in Montana. Like, they got a lot, a lot of guns. And it's, one of those, it's one of those places where there's a lot of guns in Montana. That's what I heard, though, is that they attack Montana. And I'd be like, couldn't you have picked a smarter spot to attack than Montana? Like, I'm not trying to be a hater right now, but there's a lot softer targets. Like, I'm just saying. Uh, hey, what's up, Irradiated Jello Revolution? Welcome on in. Loot Newt, Death to the Cultists, indeed. Uh, Panzer Jaeger, what's going on? Toxic, ha! Hi. How's it going, Nayum? What's up and welcome? Uh, Mixitron, Mixitreon, what's going on? Welcome on in. Uh, Rojack, what's cracking? NCE Drago, how you doing? Love the username. Clear Step, what's cracking? What's going on? Welcome on in. Uh, Mokazu, hi. Igpron, good to see you again. Welcome on back to the stream. How's your day going? Well, I'm just saying, like, as far as organization goes, Girahim, that, like, if I'm going to attack a place, I'm going to attack a place that's a soft target. Like, these guys, clearly, they don't have the spirit of Cumberland, you know what I mean? Like, they just, they don't, they haven't mastered the Tic Tacs yet. God damn it, camera. God damn it, camera. You will center. You will center, camera. Uh, Rojack, what's going on? Welcome on into the stream. Hugo, welcome on in. Chicken Sniper, how you doing? Jefferson, Hi. Welcome on in. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, Igpron. It can be a little bit rough. Uh, Mata, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the Nerd Castle. It's fantastic to have you. Welcome to the community. Jfart, five biddies right there. Appreciate that. Your grandmother died this week. Yeah, I got. I, I've been there, man. I've been there. It's a rough spot. It gets better with time, though. Time heals and all that kind of stuff. I know that sounds harsh right now, but it's true. It sucks in the moment, but you give it time. Should give it a little bit of time. Uh, Mokazu. Hey, what's going on? Oh, you going full screen, huh? Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Arthur McGuffin, I do that with my feet. Like, when I get into, like, blankets in a bed, I just rub my feet around for a while. It feels good, and I'm like... Brrr. I don't know why it feels good. It just does. It just feels good. I don't know why. You be sitting there just, like, fidgeting around in the blankies, like... Ah, getting it. A sly, what's cracking, man? Welcome to the stream. Ooh, you got chicken mole? Damn, dude. I went to dinner with my dad the other day, and that's what he got. He got chicken mole. It was pretty good. I got carne and suhugo because that's how I do it when they put the cotija on the top and they melt it just right. Oh, Ooh, that good stuff, though, man. I, I got a problem with Mexican food, dude. Like, it's a Californian thing, man. Like, in California, like, all kind of the West. Like, California, Arizona, New Mexico... Like, Mexican food is all out here. Like, I've, you don't meet anybody that don't like Mexican food. Like, I can't control myself. Most food I can stop, like, halfway through the meal and be like, I am full. Not with Mexican food. Not for me. I will eat until my eyeballs feel full. Uh, Sly, thank you very much for the sub. Welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite. Uh, there is a custom room you can hang out with and with all the other elites. And then on top of that, you got a bunch of emotes. Thanks for using your Amazon Prime sub on me. Appreciate that. Hey, what's up, Mystical? How you doing? Chill a wisp. It's 4 a.m. Good lord, man. You, you better go get some sleep tomorrow. His work is going to be terrible. Uh, Death Gaming, what's going on? Uh, they sent over a preview key. I'm allowed to play it. Yay. 
I was allowed to play it technically yesterday, but I don't stream on Saturdays, so you know, that's just the way that it goes. Yeah, man, I, uh, I got a real problem with Mexican food. Like, you put a bowl of carne and suhugo in front of me, and I will fucking destroy that shit. I will be all over that thing. I will eat until I feel physically ill. I just, I got a problem with Mexican food, man. I can't put it down. <laughs> hey, Gunners, what's going on? Uh, thank you for the biddies, dude. Appreciate that. Uh, let's see here. We're going to dive on into a new game. And we're going to play on hard because it's a shooter, and I think we can handle that. Oh, really? They're letting you pick between a dude and a guy, this one. Cool, that's new. We got that big old like, yokel belt buckle right there, man. That's, that, uh, that's the buckle stopper right there. Good lord. That's a hell of a buckle. That thing weighs a ton, man. You're going to get back muscles from that thing. Uh, please confirm your choice is final. It cannot be changed later. Finality! Apparently, we're part of the popo. Boop, boop. That's the sound of my police. Boop, boop. That's the sound of Abby's. Edgy. He's got the man bun and he likes to carve on himself. Super edge lord. He's also got the little leisure, like the leather bracelet that there's always. <gasps> Big sky country. A treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Like, Military. why are you going to... Hold on. I'll turn the volume up for now. Give me a second. Game swap so the volume's all off. There you go. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. This government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. He's got them glasses, though. He got them, he got them, them Jones glasses. We don't know what he's capable of. Their leader, Joseph Seed. They call him the father. Yeah, like, why is it the National Guard on this? They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Yo! Waco, these motherfuckers! Damn! Jesus Christ, dude! He just poked bro's eyeballs out with his thumbs! Wasting your time, there's no signal out here. That's a mustache right there. Crossing over the hand bane now. Oh fuck, there he is. Crazy motherfucker. Jesus. We're officially in Peggy country. How much longer? Just long enough for you to change your mind. I want you to understand the reality of this situation. Joseph Seed, he's not a man to be fucked with. We've had run-ins with him before. They haven't always gone our way. Why is Snoop Dogg on our team? Sometimes it's best to leave well enough alone. I thought he was busy playing yeah, SOS. Well, we have laws for a reason, Sheriff. And Joseph Seed's gonna learn that. Pratt? He don't look like Snoop Dogg anymore when he turns his head like that, but from that other angle, he looked like Snoop Dogg. This dude over here calling his underlings Nancy. Man. Rough neighborhood. Snoop Doggy Dog. Bow wow wow, wow you be on your yay. Bow wow you be on your yay. Bow wow wow you be on your yay. Bow wow you be on your yay. Peggy just put the locals gone. Now they started off harmless enough a few years back, but now they are armed to the teeth. 
six months. On a model here. Are you scared, Sheriff? We're here. Compound's just below. Let's get him. Let's get him. Give me a gun, coach. Put me in, coach. Put me in. Just kick, kick, pat, pat, pat. Getting him. Catching him with the homie grip. Yeah, this is like the first time our vehicle in Far Cry hasn't been blown up on the way to the introduction. Hey, what's up, James? I'm calling it now. The sheriff ain't gonna make it. I'm calling it right now. He's gonna get his head chopped off with an axe or some shit. He looks like that guy in the movie. Like, he's gonna walk in there and be like, You gotta stop what you're doing here, chief. And it's gonna be like, Swack! Axe to the side of the head. Hakabadoo! What's up, man? Welcome on in. I'll fight this dude today. I'll fight this dude right now. What's up? I'll give you the up down. What's going on? Look at this. I'm up downing you. That's right. What you gonna do, big hoss? I'll swipe that gimli ass looking beard up off your neck. Ah! Yo, why are we getting shot at? I was busy. I was busy. I was busy practicing my toxic masculinity. Uh, Seraphy, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Uh, Mukizo, thank you for the five dollars. Very, very kind. Appreciate that. Tip my hat to you. Oh, I died in the introduction. Well, that's good. Jesus Christ, you're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much up here. They'll respect a nine millimeter. Not every problem can be solved. They got a lot of guns, man. I don't know if a nine millimeter is gonna do it. Yo, they got pibbles. We gotta liberate these dogs out here. Why does my character walk so slow? Like, damn. Get over there, G. Well, Marshal, when we do this, we do it my way. Quietly. Calm. Yeah, dude, just hit these motherfuckers with a drone. Why are we doing this? All you gotta do is call up the Air Force. They'll have some 16-year-old with a Red Bull be like, pop, 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 over there with a drone. And all of a sudden, boom! No more cult. We're done. We don't even need to do this. This is pointless. Relax, Sheriff. You're about to get your name in the paper. Black, but now You'll be fine. Something is coming. You can feel it, can you? We are creeping toward the edge. And there will be a reckoning. That is why we started the project. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us. Take our guns. Take our freedom. They're gonna take our guns. Take our faith. Go take the guns. We will not let them. I'm like, we should take your guns, them. fool. You can't even we wear a shirt to church. Or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Like, we get it, preacher. You've been going to the gym, but ain't nobody need to see that shit. Pocket Rifty, what's going on? Thanks for the biddies, man. I have a warrant issued for your arrest. Suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now I want you to step forward and keep your hands. There's no seat. way any law enforcement department in the world is gonna send four cops to this place. They would send in a full fucking SWAT team along with the National Guard to arrest this dude. They come in. Cops use overwhelming force. That's like SOP 101 for cops. Overwhelming force. This 
moment would come. We've prepared for it. Go. Hey, what's Go. up, Eolitic? God will not let them take me. Yeah, I can't take anybody seriously who has a man bun. It's just not a terrifying haircut. Like, what's he gonna do? Fucking spill a coffee on me? Why you gotta be antagonistic, fool? We're surrounded by guns right now. You should say, handcuff this gentleman, sir. Rook, put the Just in case. Out. Press F to pay respects. Sometimes it's the best thing to do is to walk away. Yeah. I just let this run its course. These cults always end up drinking Kool-Aid or some shit anyways. Just give them six months. I bet they all be dead in the front yard, laying in weird positions, and they're like weird ass, like religious nightgowns. That's true. Oh, we gotta walk him through the middle of all of his followers in handcuffs. Come on, chief. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Marshal, take point. We're going right. On it. See, look at this big fucking Undertaker-looking dude over here. Hey, what's up, Gargantuan? How you doing? Oh, this is not going to turn out well for me. Back up. Back up. What are you doing? Everyone, keep back. Oh, no. Rookie, keep up. I am a federal marshal. I'm ordering you to stand back. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. This is a horribly this is a horribly mismanaged operation. Yeah, there you go, Snoop Dogg. Get him. Yeah, we're gonna crash. Snoop Dogg, U.S. Marshal. No! You better punch him in the neck. I'm telling you right now, punch him in the neck. Are you there? Is, is somebody there? Please. I told you that God wouldn't let you take me. Please. Hey, what's up, J uh, CJ? How you doing? Focus Trees, thank you for the five biddies, man. Appreciate that. Dispatch. Oh, God. Everything is just fine here. Oh no! He took over the police department dispatch! They're in the cult too! No one is coming to save you. Everything is fine here. Oh 
everything is unfolding according to God's plan. I am still here with you. The first seal has been broken. The collapse has begun. And we will take what we need. And we will preserve what we have. And we will kill all Snoop Dogg! Yay! I get the feeling we're in kind of a compromising position. Jesus Christ! Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Helicopter flamethrower booby trap! You didn't see it coming. I believe I might be getting shot at. Ah! Ow! Bullets hurt. Zigzag! Serpentine, Babu! Serpentine! Ow! Oh, I can kick. I like to kick, kick, kick my feet and kick all day. Kick, kick. Kick my feet and kick them right now. Quick, behind the log, they'll never find me here. Where's the part like in Far Cry 2 where I can pull bullets out of my arm with a plier? Stealth, the detection meter fills up. When you are close enough, you have been detected. Okay, do a takedown quietly. Alright. Oh, this is one of those dirty games that uses C as the crouch button. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Let me get you guys some subtitles now that I'm not in a cutscene where you can't put in subtitles without canceling the cutscene. Uh, gameplay, is it in here? There we go. There needs to be some kind of unification. Like, you ever notice in some games, it's in audio, but in other games, it's in gameplay? You can never tell. I've got a stick. He'll protect us as long as we trust in the father. I'll do anything he asks me. We all uh, get beat with a stick. Ah! Is that a fucking bear? What the fuck? Oh, my stick broke. It's a honey badger. From everything I understand about badgers, they don't care. Yeah, take that. I've defeated you with this giant pile of wood. I thought it was like a baby bear for a second. I got scared. How do I pick up that guy's gun? That guy had a pistol. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I got a pistol now. Yup. Somebody's getting shotted. Alright, so we got like a pipe in here. A pipe in here. Uh, we've got, like, somebody's license plate collection. Well, like, weirdly enough, a branch off of a tree isn't enough to kill a badger. Like, I thought it might be, but unfortunately, it just wasn't, like, it wasn't ready to go. Oh, there's a baseball bat, too? I'll take a baseball bat. How do I swap my weapons? Alright, that'll work. Whatever. Is there anything in here that I desire? Where is your cult treasure? Dude, I'm about to shoot everybody. Please believe. Ooh, a backpack. Uh, That's a broomstick. I don't think that's going to be helpful. I'm picking up bullets because their house is horribly... Ooh, that's a cool gun right there. I kind of want that gun. Can I not go that way? I guess I can't go that way. Man, they even got bullets in the toy box. Alright, I got ammo now. I got ammo. We're going to fight these dudes. Let's go.
So, like, where am I supposed to be going right now? Uh. Uh, the real CJ, thank you for the biddies, man. Appreciate that. Oh, the father's about to see to something. Father's about to see to something. Oh, dun 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 Father's about to see to your soul, son. Who's getting shot at right now? It's not me, right? Oh, I'm full on loot. I can't have any more loot. Okay. Is there anybody up here in this camp that needs to get whacked? Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. This guy was all by himself? Why did they exile him to the side of town with a gun, a campfire, and a bedsheet? Like, what did he do for that? House for sale by owner. Desperate. Yeah, I bet if this shit was going on here too, I'd be trying to unload my property as well. I'd be like, yo, we need to get the fuck out of Dodge, like, right now. Let's move someplace where there's, like, civilization and not bad things happening. Like, that dude had a pet badger, though. Like, we're pretty far out in the hood if somebody's got, like, a pet badger. Ooh. Lots of the ammos. I don't want to get caught up too much just, like, over here looting. But... Maybe... We'll find safety inside this house. Oh, 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 oh Jesus Christ. Rook, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bro, you need a shower. We can't fight a cult dirty. These people need a vacuum badly. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. Ooh. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. I got a real gun now. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula. And then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard. And we're gonna take out the rest of these- Hey, what's up, Matias? How you doing? Oh, we're about to have a gunfight. How did they know? I think I got that one. There we go. We go full auto on a ma. Let's do this thing. Ah! Uh, uh, Gotica! Ow! Apparently, I have med kids. What I really need is a grenade so I can dig these dudes out of cover. Is there a lean? Oh, it's not a lean. Cover you? There's no window on that side of the house, bro. Oh! Also, I'm out of bullets. I need a resupply. I'm super out of bullets right now. You talking to me or the truck, man? You better chill with that. I'm over here doing some fucking John Wick shit. Get in the car! Get in the car! I ain't leaning out, fuck you! I can get shot inside the car? Come on, man. Uh, Mr. Smiley, what's going on? Thank you for the follow, I appreciate that. 
Like, how are you supposed to get to the car with that many people shooting at you? I'm gonna stay right here. Oh, well, apparently it's just gonna, like, give me a pass. Yeah, drive by, son! Snoop Dogg knows how it's done! Hunting! Hunting! It's the Highland Way. Uh, Zonder, thank you very much for the follow, man. I don't think cars are this bulletproof. Yeah, you better get back in the car. Well, maybe if you stop driving off cliffs and shit, I can aim a gun. Ah, oh, Jesus. I don't think we're making it out of this. Ooh, got that one. All right, give me the med kit, give me the med kit. Oh, Jesus. Things are going really, really wrong right now. Got him! Are you fucking for real right now? Is that like a P-39 or whatever the fuck that thing is? A P-90X? I don't know what that plane's called. But it's like one of those World War II planes. That dude had an RPG. Jesus. We kind of got problems right now. Damn it. Maybe I picked the wrong difficulty. Jesus, man. It takes like one bullet to fucking kill you. Like, and everything on Earth is shooting at me right now. Like, good lord. Oh, we gotta do the whole fucking thing again? Alright, I'm adjusting the difficulty. Fuck this. Like, if they're gonna put me in a fucking shooting gallery and just be like, fuck you. Like, I'm sorry, but I can play on hard once we actually get into the game. This event is fucking dog shit. Hey, Anthologica, thank you very much for the 500 biddies, man. Appreciate it. Alright, I gotta hunt the deer of good luck again. I didn't hunt him good enough last time. Yeah, let's stay inside the car for a minute until that's no longer an issue. Yeah, I'm gonna finish the intro on normal and then we'll bump it up to hard. Because I, this is like, I don't like being railroaded and to get my ass whooped. Like, dying here is not really your fault. It's just kind of random guns being shot while you're stuck inside of a vehicle. Alright. Uh, I'm working on it. Alright. How is that not stopping them? I have dynamite, goddammit. There we go. Uh, Texan Brad Daniel and Ermix, thank you very much for the follow. Don't you tell me they have fucking air support. Man, fuck him! Get some! Murka! Oh, say, can you see? Oh, fuck, that's not good. Everybody getting some. What you got to say to me? Mm, what you say? What you say? What did he say? Ah, you hit the moo moo. Yeah, he is. Jesus Christ.
Oh, shit. I was going to go for an aerial kill right there, but... Yo, is that a 50? I shot him in the head. Why is he not dead? Fucking bulletproof cultist, man. It's true. I hate it when video games, you shoot somebody right between the eyes with like a 7.62 and they're like, I'm fine. And they take like five more hits. That's what drove me nuts about Far Cry 2. Is everything was just like a fucking bullet soak in that game where you're like, God, how many bullets can this guy take? Uh, not really, CJ. Episode 1 and 2 were pretty bad, and so I'm not- I don't hold a lot of hope for the story mode in Long Dark. I'll just keep playing survival mode. I don't think they care about that, dude. I don't think you have jurisdiction here. I'll be honest, our ratio is pretty good right now. We killed a lot of those people. The authorities who tried to take me from you are now in the loving embrace of my family. Save for one. Let's answer the real question. Do I still have my baseball bat? Oh, I've been zip tied. All you need is leverage to kill a zip tie though. Just don't pull directly on it. You gotta twist it, and then you gotta use a lever motion. It'll pop them off. Yeah, Snoop Dogg's gonna have a rough day, man. You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. Hey, what's up, Loot Newt? How you doing? But mostly it means we're all fucked. Eh. Seems likely. Dutch Joy, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Nerdcastle community. Great to have you. Because he looked like Snoop Dogg for a second when he had like a certain angle. He looked like Snoop Dogg for a second. An and now. so I just ran with it. They've been waiting for it. For years. Waiting for somebody <laughs> to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy. And kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. So like, what, is this guy like a Vietnam vet or something? That'd be pretty dope, like, we could use a Vietnam vet ally. Would just be to hand you over? Uh, War Boren, thank you for the 100 biddies. Hey, what's up, Noble? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Also, Dark Worm, hi. That's a big fucking knife, man. It doesn't even have a locking blade on it. Like, what you need a knife that big with an unfixed blade for? That just seems like a recipe for cutting your own fingers off. Get out of that uniform. Mad hater, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. What's up, Rob? How you doing? We'll see if we can unfuck this situation. Uh, Askel, thank you very much for the follow, man. Welcome to the Nerdcastle community. It's great to have you. Welcome to the stream. What did you say? Mm -mm -mm. Ooh, Askel got the Amazon Prime sub, too. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. I can change my clothes. You can make some choices before we proceed to character customization. Okay. So there are a number of faces we can pick from here. I'm gonna be that guy. That guy seems cool. And then... I don't know. Oh, we got different hairstyles and stuff, too. Alright. I don't know. I thought he looked kind of Native American slash Hawaiian. And I'm like a quarter Hawaiian. So I was like, oh, we're going to roll through. We're going to roll through Montana with that with that vengeance of Pele. We're going to be up in this bitch. I think I like the Bruno Mars haircut. Couple, like, uh, clean-ass fades. Gotcha. Oh my good sweet lord. 
That's the Hawaiian standard right there, dude. There are so many mullets in Hawaii. You have no idea. Motherfuckers, they rock those mullets out there, dude. Oh, that's the stuff. Good lord, man. That's a Tennessee top hat right there. He got the hockey hair, son. You know we have to do it. Like, I don't have a choice. Let's go for it. Yup, we gotta, we gotta rock the Tennessee top hat. Uh, theoretical permutations, thank you for that. So we got upper body, we could pick different shirts. Uh, let's go with like the, let's, let's go with the, let's go with the African warlord tank top. That sounds good. No, I picked that. Make that happen. Yup. There we go. Oh, we're going full on now. There it is. There it is. What we got for headwear? Just a bunch of trucker hats? Nah, if they ain't got a flat bill, I ain't feeling it. Take that thing off. We gotta show off this glorious... We gotta show off this glorious mullet. They got misfits gloves? Well, I got something to say. I rock some misfits gloves today. And it doesn't matter much to me. As long as they're not wet. Alright. Dude, I got misfits gloves. Alright. Never gonna get me, never gonna get me, never gonna get me, I'm the Crimson Ghost. Never gonna get me, never gonna get me, never gonna get me, I'm the Crimson Ghost. Hey, The Apprentice, uh, you're quite welcome, man. Thank you very much for the 1500 biddies. It's very generous. Why don't you call the nearest military base? I'm sure there are military bases in Montana. Hit one of them up and be like, yo, send out a fucking, you know, a fast action reaction team. Go ahead, spell it out. <laughs> uh, Gespent Wolf, thank you very much for the one year. You got that, you got that, you got that Hello silver again, icon Spark. now, man. How are you doing? I'm look. Why do we live in a bunker, dude? What kind of prepper nonsense is this? Uh, I'm gonna get a shovel just in case I gotta bludgeon somebody. You never know. It's not my favorite weapon, but I'll make it work. Timmy Lee, thank you for the four months, dude. Appreciate that. Wait, what is- I'm gonna take the pipe instead. It seems more wieldable in this given situation. Keep door closed. You know the problem with these bunkers is all that somebody has to do is find the fucking air vent and shove an alcohol rag in it and everybody inside dies. Like, that's pretty much all- these bunkers are fucking pointless. You're better off taking your chances in the woods and just laying low. Richard Dutch Roosevelt served two nights in jail for contempt of court after contesting his right to collect rainwater in what the state defined as a reservoir. Mr. Roosevelt has operated this rainwater collection without a proper permit and flagrant violation of Montana law, said the Water Resource Department Deputy Director Edwin Garcia. He is contesting the charges. Yeah, some places, because of the rainwater and the runoff, you're not allowed to gather water in barrels because it fucks with, like, the streams and stuff. Like, and if everybody's using barrels and whatnot to collect their own rainwater, it'll fuck with the actual runoff. And it'll mess with the ecosystem. It's not good. I know it seems like a stupid law, but I've studied hydrology and it can't affect things. Uh, Dark Worm, thank you for the 100 biddies, and Octavian of Roma, thank you for the biddies as well. Hey, what's up, Rune Brute? How you doing? He has feces? What's he got in there? He's got some... He's got some tetras? What's going on inside of there? Got some tetras. Couple of tangs. I can feel that. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. This is Dutch. Anybody? Oldest brother of the seeds, in charge of training their militia up in the Whitetail Mountains. One thing it believes in is the sacrifice of the weak. Seems to be running a few psychological experiments up north. All sorts of nightmare stories about people turning on one another at the drop of the hat. It's been linked to the creation of the monster wolves of north the cult calls judges. 
Joseph C. is the leader of the project at Eden's Gate. He believes a great collapse is coming and thinks of himself as a modern-day Noah. He thinks God talks to him. He's told to save as many souls as he can, and now that he's started the reaping, his followers are willing to die for him. He said his people build three massive bunkers to protect themselves when his prophecy comes true. The guy is an absolute nut job. Okay. Uh, Amir, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Welcome to the community. And then, uh, Cry and Shame, thank you for the eight biddies. Hey, what's going on, uh, Elk? How you doing? Welcome. And then thank you for that Amazon Prime sub. Welcome to the Nerdcastle Elite. Enjoy your time in the Nerdcastle Lounge, exclusively available to the elites, and also the availability of new emotes that you can spam as much as you want. Uh, youngest of the Seed Brothers may be the most sadistic, in charge of recruiting for the cult. Marking, cleansing, confession, atonement. Those are the four steps he puts everyone through to become a member if they survive. John tells everyone to accept the power of yes as a way to get his followers to do whatever the fuck he wants. A grade A psychopath. Alright, Drago, I'll see ya. Faith. Doesn't know how she's related. It seems like she just showed up one day. She'll spin you a sob story, but Faith is a liar and a manipulator. She'll poison your mind with bliss if you give her the chance. Anyone who goes wandering into the Henbane River winds up dead or walking the path to become one of those brain-dead angels doing all the cult's labor. Okay, Drago, I'll see you next time, man. Thanks for coming to the stream. Can I have whatever's in that safe? No. Good. You found something that fits. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Yeah, no shit. Is that your partners are alive. For now. Hey, thank you very much for the biddies, Ronan. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want him back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken too. The problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's gotta be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're gonna do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Are we gonna be skateboarding? Is that why we need bearings? Ooh. What's up, guns? How you doing? Yup. Uh, so Q will open a weapon wheel. Ah, that's why the number keys weren't working. Okay, navigate within a slot by selecting... Alright. We'll figure it out. It'll be all good. Uh, now, no, Naota Freaks, thank you very much for the 100 bitties and keggers. Thank you for the six bits as well. I'm hoping they do better with this one than they did with Far Cry 4. Like, I liked the gameplay of Far Cry 4, but, like, the storyline was a little weak. Like, Pagan Min was cool, but he wasn't nearly as badass as the dude from Far Cry 3. That dude was out of his goddamn mind, and that's what I liked about him. He's a very Joker-esque character. Alright, so, let me get this 1911 out. We'll go find somebody to fuck up. I once was lost, but now I'm found. Now was I blind. If you're gonna build a resistance, there's some things you need to know. There's four ways you can go about this. First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people. They might just fight alongside you if you help them. Alright, so rescue Second, civilians. You can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. I did, Licorice. Third, I did. You can tackle resistance missions. There are a lot of folks out there waging their own war against this cult. And they could sure use your help. And last, if you're really looking for a fight, you can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. Why did he say outpost Third, like he's Canadian? Americans don't say out, they don't say outpost. He said outpost. He had like, I think that actor's Canadian. He's trying to sneak in and pretend he's a Montana native, but he said outpost. He didn't say outpost. There's a difference. I'm pretty sure he's Canadian. He's undercover. It's okay though. He's a Canadian friend. He'll help us. Uh, hola, Carvajal. Welcome on in. Good to have you. Uh, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the community. For now, head south and take out any culture you see. Need, would you? Don't you? Yeah, I was gonna say he said out like a couple of times, not out. He goes out. That's how you know. That's how you catch it. That's how you catch a Canuck that's trying to sneak through undercover. 
You'd be like, mm, say outhouse. And he'd be like, outhouse. And you'd be like, oh, I got you. What is this over here? Can I kill it? Oh, I see you little bastards. I see you little bastards. Oh, line up in a straight line. Destroy cult property and you'll get resistance points. Do I spend them on cool new abilities? Does my sex appeal go up? Is that like nerve gas? What is that? Oh, this dude's about to get got. Dun 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 Oh, break your neck. Break your neck. Alright, that's the last one. Let's loot it on up. Uh, so we got a throwable in the weapon wheel by holding Q. Yeah, okay. That's cool. Whatever. Uh, we got a Molotov and we got a 50 cal. I don't know. Uh, Kaz Lion, welcome to the Nerd Castle. Good to have you. Welcome on in. I don't really... Oh, there's a gas tank inside of it. Hey. Ooh! Uh, Dracone Dominus, welcome to the Nerd Castle. Thank you for that Amazon Prime sub. Very, very kind of you. I appreciate your support. Welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite. What is that up there? He said to head to the south. So I'm gonna head to the south. So how long do you think it'll be before there's dumbass articles on the internet about how this game doesn't support religious freedom? And it's promoting like... You know what? I'm not gonna go there in this stream. I just saw Viver's face in my... I saw Viver's face in my head and she was like, please no. I'm not gonna go there. Never mind. Never mind. We're just gonna leave it alone. So liberate civilians to get resistance points. Alright, we're gonna do it. I'm not going there. I'm not going there. We're gonna save these sinners whether they want it or not. Are you sure? Oh, I think I can take these guys. I wonder if this one will end up as a chosen or an angel. Where's the deputy hiding? So we got Siggies up here. Some Royals. See, this guy needs to get on that. You gotta smoke Newports, man. They make you tougher. Uh, Kojo, thank you for the 10 biddies. I appreciate that. Newport menthols. Just what the doctor ordered. It'll fix anything. Except for lung cancer. It doesn't fix that. Sinner, you better tell us what you know. What's up, girl? Uh. Sinner. How does he not see me right now? This dude has the worst peripheral vision I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, no more neck for you. I thought I was done for. I have liberated you, Thanks. sir. These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. Oh, cool. Apparently there's Ooh, an arrow. I just saw the cult grab a guy down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun. And return the favor. How come I can't pick up that rifle? Because it looks way cooler than my rifle. That one has a paint job. I want the one with the paint job. I'm trying to be a gun nerd. Proximity explosive. What's a proximity explosive? Hold up. Hey. Oh my god. So we have like a remote detonated plastic explosive. And then we have a device that explodes if anybody gets near it. Oh my god. We got some, we got some fun things now. We got the... Uh, so, there's Silver Lake Conservation Tower, Johnson Lookout Tower. If there's a Johnson in this forest, we're gonna find it. There's one right there! <laughs> Stop looking at my Johnson! Oh yeah, I forgot to adjust the difficulty back up. That intro was dumb for the difficulty. There we go. Now that I actually can, like, choose my strategy and whatnot, it shouldn't be quite as bad. CD Coolest, welcome to the Nerd Castle community. Glad to have you. Thank you for the follow and welcome on in. It's great to see you. I think I'm gonna loot this place real fast. This dude drying weed over here? My man, I know where I'm hanging out from now on. We looking at I'll be looking at Johnson's too, just like he is. That means I get free weed. I can't thank you enough. Well try. They were gonna kill you. Was blind, but now I see. Can I zip line? Or do I need like special gear to zip line? Do I get a wingsuit in this game? God, I hope I get a wingsuit. 
I love games that give me wingsuits. Uh, Raven Sword, I'm doing good, man. How's your day going on? Is it moving along? Things going well? This pipe seems to be exposed. You don't want to walk around with your pipe exposed. Hey, Mike, I tried to get into the underground stash, but a pipe burst and flooded everything. I have no idea what's still salvageable. We need juice to run the pump to drain the water. I know the power switch is in the boathouse, but it's locked, and you didn't give me the key, so I'll leave that to you. Okay. So who has the key? Oh, it's tab to follow it. So we got the Johnson Lookout Tower, Dutch's Bunker, a.k.a. the Dutch Oven. And then we've got Sunken Funds over there. Yeah, let's go have a look. Let's see what... Oh, really? I'm gonna go take a look. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take. Thank you, Void Breaker. I appreciate that. Knowing that I'll get a wingsuit has made me feel all the better about this game. A wingsuit is all that it takes for a game to be fun. Never mind the fact that it takes intensive training to learn how to use a wingsuit. Our character will pick one up and know how to use it instantly because that's how video games work. You need like 2,000 hours of skydiving time and shit, like 2,000 jumps to get wingsuit certified. It's pretty rough. It takes a long time to get wingsuit certified. Uh, Jinx Socks, thank you very much for the biddies. And even then, like, even people that are good at wingsuiting, there's a decent chance you'll hit, like, a fucking low pressure area and just burn in hella hard. A high was, was lost, but now I'm found. Was blind, but now. I was a dead man. Thanks. He got that high tech shit. He got that high tech thigh guard just in case. Uh, Jinx, thank you for the five bitties. Very, very cool. So I've got Neil Madison. He's a soldier. Wait, I can have homeboys? I got faith in you, deputy. Oh shit, son. This just went very, very hey, Saints deputy. Row. Now that you're partnered up, the day you should head to the forest research station. Ghost's been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore. How cold are rivers in Montana? I feel like rivers in Montana are gonna be really fucking cold. From all the runoff and what now. Uh, they said in the boathouse there's like a switch or something. I'm down for some Nintendo. Enemy spotted. Who's got the key? There's an enemy? Where's there an enemy? Tag him. Is it that dude way over there? Oh yeah, it is. Wonder if there's bullet drop. I bet there is. Without an optic, I don't feel comfortable taking that shot on an iron sight. Starting like a open area gun battle if I don't have to. Uh, let's see here. So there's sunken funds. Find a way into the boathouse. I wonder if there's a hole in the floor. There's a hole in the floor, dear Liza, dear Liza. There's a hole in the boat floor, dear Liza. A hole. Yep. That's about what I figured. With what shall I swim it, dear Henry, dear Henry? I'm gonna stick with my shovel for right now. Oh, he can swim too. Good for him. What a guy. So that thing looks a little bit unsound. Uh, there's the key right there. And so that lets me out of there. But they said I had to flick a switch or something like that in here. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I assume that like swimming in Montana is like swimming in Tahoe. It's just a bad idea. It's gonna be so cold your nuts are gonna fall off. Hey, game and then you'll be like, yo, so far. I used to have nuts. Now I don't have nuts. What happened here? Now I am nutless. And I kind of like the I kind of like the big guys. They've been with me my whole life, you know. They put a tremendous strain on my back, but I love them for what they are. Uh, speaks little. Thank you for giving away that sub right there to CD Coolest. I appreciate that. That's super awesome, man. I don't know what that is, but it seems more badass than like a shovel. So I'm gonna take it. Uh, what else we got going on? 
So we found some arrows. We found a doo-doo toilet. Um, ooh. What's up, money? How you doing? That didn't look like $250. That looked like a lot more than $250 to me. I have seen $250 in, like, ones. Oh, I can break that. Cool. And that did not look like $250. Ooh. Wait, I can only carry one weapon? Why? You're going to make me pick between a rifle and a compound bow? Ooh. What's up, money? If you're looking to make a bigger impression, you may want to build some dynamite. Luckily, folks around here have been stockpiling all the materials you might need. So just grab them up. Let's see what the bow feels like in this game. I really like the bow in Far Cry 3 and Far Cry 4. I used it a lot, and so maybe I'll use it in this one too. My inventory is full of melee weapons. I'm pretty sure I only have the one melee weapon. Because it drops the other one when I pick it up. So I got grenades. I got smoke grenades. What other stuff is in here? I got a roster. Wait, I can have a pet bear? He has the right to bear arms. He will exercise his right to attack. <laughs> Somebody watches. <gasps> I can have a kitty? Oh, I'm gonna have a pet mountain lion. Oh, I'm gonna have a puma. I think I only have room for like one weapon. Yeah, I think I probably got to get additional holsters and stuff like in the other games. So where did it want me to go now? Let's have a look. So it wants me to go down to that area, reach the station. But what if I go in this direction? I clear out the rest of the island, though. Like, what if I do that instead? As long as I don't have to climb any towers and, like, fly with any eagles, I think I'll be okay. Uh, you wanted to see the perks. That's my journal, roster, character customization. I don't see a perk menu around anywhere. Well, if the bow is a lot like the bows in other games, I'm probably going to like it then. We've got Lupine. Okay. Alright, Anthologic. I'll see you later. Thanks for coming to the stream. I wonder if making birds run off will alert people to your presence. Either way, we are going to hunt the greatest game. I like the way my Misfits gloves actually show on my character. I was wondering if that would be true. Scream! Dude, I like the Misfits. But I only like the Misfits when uh, Michael Graves was the singer. A lot of people think that's blasphemy, but I don't know. I like Michael Graves. He's a good singer. Oof. Yeah, that's a pretty good bow. That bow ain't fucking around. That thing's got some oomph to it. Okay. For fuck's sake. You didn't even fire a shot, man. What are you complaining about? It's not like you contributed to this adventure at all. Like, what do I do with my loot when I'm full? Is there a place I can go to possibly do better with me loots? Yo, don't go over there, man. Oh. How come it didn't explode this? Maybe I need dynamite or something to make it work. Dude, I'm tripping balls right now. I should probably stop standing next to that thing. Yeah, let me get the let me get the nade. Oh fuck. There we go. That'll do it. Hey, sneezing gal. Thank you for the $10. I appreciate that. I'm glad you can make it. Uh, tip of my hat to you. Thank you for that. I very much appreciate it. 
Is that a big ass fish right there? It is. I'm gonna bow hunt this motherfucker. Did I get him? Where are you at, Trout? I know I got you. I know I got you, Trout. Why are you lying? This dude over here is swimming like a motorboat. His new nickname is Jet Ski because he swims fast. That's true. Can we throw dynamite in here and go redneck fishing? That's also a interesting, that's an interesting observation. Maybe? Everyone here has owned something small at one point or another. Being handy gives you an edge. You're always needed by someone for something. All right. Yeah, how are we tainting the water supply by blowing up those tanks? Heads up, bad guys. They can get fucked. I don't care about them. Where are they at? Show them to me. Where are they at? All right, so G, I can order my gun for hire to move to a targeted location. And then I can tell him to target an enemy. Undetected, your gun for hire will try to stay in stealth. All right. Uh, gun for hire, you go right here. Get my back. Uh oh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was awesome. Nice. Hey, what's up, Lime Gruber? Peggy's won't be back after the ass whooping you just laid on him. While you're there, check around and see if any folks are left alive. Oh, wow, we got a bunch of RP for that one. Hell yeah. Like, I'm kind of bummed out by the fact that my loot is full, so I can't loot anything else. Like, that's a that's a fairly major disappointment to me. When do they hook me up with the inevitable arms dealer that's in every single one of these games who's like, Hey, I'm ex inexplicably on American land with tons of illegal guns. Come and buy one. I'm super open about the fact. I used to be CIA. They're always from, like, some fucking Homeland Security agency, but they quit every single time. Like, oh, yeah, I used to be CIA. You know. Like, yeah, sure, sure. Sure you were. That's funny, because I used to be Thor, God of Thunder, but then, you know, I gave it all up. Do something. You're an angel. Thank you. Aren't the angels the bad guys? I don't think I'm an angel. Feels pretty good, Anonymous. The cult's been creeping around the island for weeks. Looks like they're trying to set up a base of operations at the old ranger station. Yeah, dude, I need DACA. The bow doesn't satisfy my desire for DACA. Like, I don't really care about stealth. All I want to do is just be like, and spray neighborhoods. Apparently, I've got fasteners now. Oh, and six dollars. Maybe I should be looking at counters and stuff. The reaping has begun. The Father has commanded us to raise these shrines throughout the region to spread his word. Once it is built, the sinners will try to deface it. We must defend these structures at all costs. We will build the shrine so Father's wisdom will take root and grow. Okay. Uh, he's a U.S. Marshal, the main character. So they went in with like a small team to try to arrest the cult leader because they're fucking stupid. And then the cult leader whooped their asses with like all kinds of like militia and shit. And so now we're basically the only guy here who's left. Neil, what are you doing, man? Gotcha. Get down here. Why you gotta be a show-off about it, man? You could just walk around. Look, I had a chance to zipline. I never get to zipline. If I see an opportunity to zipline, I zipline, son. Uh, how is the bad guy? So far, he seems psycho. Oh, uh, Rodanosaurus, thank you for the follow. Kevin C, thank you for the follow as well, and welcome to the Nerd Castle. Good to have you as part of our community. So, like, where am I supposed to go now? Did I do anything gangster enough? 
Oh, I gotta keep I gotta keep knocking out outposts. Gotcha. Let's get over here. It's time for us to do what we do. I haven't got to say sheriff department. I haven't got to say sheriff's department like a redneck yet this entire game. And that's all I wanted. The fuck did you say about me, Goose? Please believe. I will put tracers on you so fast. That Goose thought he he thought we play. That Goose thought we weren't clicked up. Please believe, Goose. Hey, what's up, Angel? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Uh, Dekno, welcome on in, man. Alright, we're going in hot on this outpost. We're going in hot on this one. Gotta find a good attack angle, though. Gotta have the angles on them. Alright, alright. This dude over here trying to flank. He thinks I don't know. He thought he was a sneaky motherfucker. And now he's Swiss cheese. I thought the beat was going to go a little bit longer. Now I'm disappointed. Where's all the guys that I killed? I wanted to loot their loots and put it inside of my pockets for later. What's the point in being a backwoods hero if you can't make a little profit in the whole thing? What's up, Chief? I can't thank you enough. Alright, we found a map. There was an attempted arrest, but the sheriff's office released a statement saying any such action is waiting on legal clarification. Hey, Lance. I'm not sure what to advise. The seeds don't have any claim to the property. The station is built on federal land after all. But if their people are traipsing around the area and, what did you say, taking measurements and such? Anyway, those folks from Eden's Gate could potentially be charged with trespassing. I know they're kind of weird and unsociable, but I think if you give them a harsh word and a hard stare, they'll back off. I mean, how dangerous are these nutjobs gonna be? Definitely gonna be muted. That's a bummer, too. Well, it doesn't look like there's much in the way of loot over here. So, let's go ahead and get back to it. We got a job to do. Uh, ID Crit, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the Nerdcastle community. Really glad to have you. We focus on positivity here. Hanging out with chat and just having a good time. I'm a variety streamer. I play pretty much everything new that's coming out. So if you don't like what I'm playing one day, chances are the next day you will more than likely find something you like. Uh, for those of you out there that are on the fence right now, if you hit that follow button up there, you'll get notifications whenever I go live if you're enjoying the stream. It's a great way to come back and hang out. And of course, if you're interested in following up and seeing what my schedule is for the week, I'll be posting my schedule this week for Twitch streaming uh, right there on twitter.com slash splattercatgames. So you can check that out there as well. That's a big ass radio tower, bro. I'm not like acrophobic, but I'm like a little phobic. Hey, what's up, Double Tap? How you doing? Oh, nice, Angel. It's been a long time since I did Stardew Valley. I've been doing all kinds of random stuff on YouTube for a very, very long time. I rotate fast. You want to know something interesting? You see that piece of paper? You see that piece of paper, like, on the floor right there? 
There's cat puke underneath that, and I didn't want it to be on stream, but I was too lazy to clean it up, so I just put paper over the top of it. Welcome to the way I live my life. Like a dirty trash person. <gasps> the revolution is now! Unspeakable, don't tell people about my weekend occupation, man. I'm not proud of it. YouTube's a hard life to live in. I need that extra money so that my family can get by. That's Faith's territory. The little sister. I've heard all sorts of stories about people losing their minds in a place called The Bliss. Now head west to the Holland Valley. Dude, I love Far Cry. I've been a big Far Cry fan since Far Cry 2. I got Far Cry 2 and I was like, this game is super underrated and I like it a lot. Like, looking for diamonds and stuff. And so, like, I've loved Far Cry ever since then. Far Cry 3 blew my mind. It was so good. I, to this day, firmly believe that Far Cry 3 is as close to a perfect video game as you could possibly get. Satisfying shooter mechanics. Fantastic storyline. Lots of free roaming and random collectible shit if that's what you're into. The firefights are fantastic. The weapons are cool. RPG mechanics. It's very close to the perfect game. Like, it's really, really, really good. I thought that... I thought... So, the only game that I thought compared to Far Cry 3 was Horizon Zero Dawn. But Horizon Zero Dawn really loses steam like halfway through the game. And it just gets boring. Like, I loved the first half of Horizon Zero Dawn. And then the second half, I was just like, man, this game really kind of fell off a cliff there, didn't it? Like, they just failed to give you, like, you have all these things you unlock, but they all feel like the abilities don't matter, and it's all, like, default stuff you should have had since the beginning of the game. It's like, oh, you can run on a wire now instead of walking on a wire, and I'm like, that's not fun. Like, you want cool stuff, like Far Cry 3, where you can, like, teleport in between bad guys and stab them in the neck. Like, you want fun stuff like that. Primal's pretty good. I liked Primal, but it had no storyline. I really liked Far Cry Primal, but like the lack of storyline killed it for me. Like it just felt like a big map that you could dick around on. Fog should be clearing soon, which means we can get you off this island. Sit tight, shouldn't be much longer. Apparently we unlocked a Chivo. Good for us. Uh, Tannis with a tier 3 sub right there. Thank you for your generosity, man. I very much appreciate that. Uh, that's very, very cool oh, of you. Shit. Thank you. Deputy, I'm picking up something new out of Holland Valley. It's a broadcast from John. You need to see this. This seems like the kind of place that local kids go to drink beer and just, like, sit there and be bored. We are all sinners. Every one of us. You, me. Even the father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true? What if I told you that everything could be overcome? You embraced. Send me 1999 right now for your free care package to learn how sin can be wiped from your life. From sin. I'm Pat Robertson. From the power Robertson. Of just one word. Yeah. Selling you the power of healing bullshit for the last 50 years. Yes. Uh, the Real Sows, thank you for the follow. Yes. Dan Man's Gutter Soldier, thank you for the follow yes. as well. My problem is that sin I is the most fun be things be in right. life. Yes. Like sinning is the I best. Must be redeemed. My family's super You're religious. Know that you have been selected. Dude, why is he got you that like donate to my Kickstarter music in the background? Your sins, and you will be We're just four guys with a dream from Nevada. Please help Don't us make work. it happen with your eighty thousand dollars. 
is totally not gonna tank and fail. I promise. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Hey, what's up, LCP? How you doing? <laughs> he does look like Casey Affleck. <laughs> Zip line. I can shoot on the zip line? That seems markedly dangerous. I don't think that's gun safe. Oh shit. I found a thing. Oh, there's a dead guy in here. Sorry, bro, you didn't make it. He's got the tin baseball bat. You have to take the aluminum baseball bat, bro. Like, just that tink sound you get. Oh, it's such a satisfying sound. Just that wink sound you get. Oh, that's the, that's the sound effect right there. It's oh so satisfying. Ooh, I got body armor too. Oh shit, we in here in the fort? Mama, please don't tell dad. I don't understand how he can listen to that asshat Father Joseph. His dad joined one of them reaping crews to what, like fight our neighbors? Jack and I stayed out by the ranger station where he worked last year. We're okay. We're gonna get married and start a real life. I'm Deedon's gate folk are everywhere. Please stay safe and try to get dad to see sense. Love you, Mona. P.S. I have an inexplicably deep voice for a woman. I may chase down a career like Cher did. What did that do? Oh, I almost locked myself inside the trailer. Wink! Oh, I can't wait to get somebody with one of these. My Whopper. So, like, where did it want me to go? I assume his region, since he had the- <gasps> We can get a doggo. Hold on. I- Uh, J Pick, thank you very much for that subscription. Welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite. I very much appreciate it. I am supported entirely by my community here, and you guys make my life oh so sweet. And honestly, like before I was a streamer, no joke, before I was a streamer and a YouTuber, I was in a rough place. Like I had sold all my furniture to pay rent. Like I couldn't get a job, couldn't find anything. Was It was rough, man. Sleeping on the floor because I sold my mattress and everything else. It was bad. My life was on a fucked up trajectory, and the internet changed that, so I very much appreciate it. Uh, I mean, I also blame World of Warcraft. It was kind of World of Warcraft's fault. I had a very fucking real addiction to World of Warcraft, and it almost fucked up my life. Like, I was playing like 12 or 13 hours a day. I gained like 50 pounds. It was bad. It was really, really bad. Yeah! Automatic gun hunting! Where did the deer go? I shot it with a lot of bullets. I'm pretty sure that deer's ass is not feeling so good right now. Where did he go? God damn it. This is the shitty part of hunting. Motherfucker, you don't know me like that! Please believe! Are you guys captives? What's up? What's cracking? Uh, deck no, thank you for the fitty biddies, man. I appreciate that. Uh, Dark Templar, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, my life was in a fucked up place before I met my hey, wife. Got a sec? Like, my wife, like, I, I, I firmly blame me as a human being on who I am right now as my wife. Like, she, like, enabled me and she, like, believed in all the shit that I wanted to do. There's this girl out there, Skylar, amazing angler. She's looking for some help to catch the Admiral. You should track her down when you got the chance. Stay alive. Like, my wife legit turned my life around because, like, I wanted, like, to impress her and I, like, wanted to do good. Ooh, there's a shotgun? Ooh. A little fucking Remington pump over here? Yeah, let's go with that. That sounds good and brutal. I'll take that. They- that's their religious signal or whatever. Uh, Nick Haynes, thank you for the follow. Are you guys bad guys? What's up? Hey! Hey, sir! Step out of the vehicle, sir! Sir, I'm gonna need you to step out of the vehicle. Oh, he's using a combat deer. Ah! Oh. You about to have a rough day, my friend. You about to have a rough day, my friend. 
that dude just tried to bust straight on through. Smart man right there. Don't sit there and get shot at. You ram that intersection. That's like hood living 101. If somebody tries to carjack you or anything, you run that red light right now. That's why you breeze red lights in my neighborhood at night. You don't stop at red lights. Fucking breeze that shit. Fucking don't stop for shit. Breeze straight through that motherfucker. If the cops pull you over, they pull you over. It is what it is. Oh yeah, I gotta skin this deer over here. So, hunt animals and skin them to get bait. Get bait through the weapon wheel? Okay. So it uses bait just like Ford did. Gotcha. Can I ride this? Oh shit yeah, I stole this dude's ATV, son. I had an ATV when I was a kid. My dad traded an ATV for a job that he did. And so we had like a big old fucking like 5 million cc ATV. We used to tear it up. Hey, what's up? How you doing, Paint? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Welcome on in. I mean, it's only certain parts of the neighborhood that you run red lights. Deputy, you've crossed into the hen bang. Don't trust anything you see. What you got for me? And sure as shit, don't believe a word that Faith says. What you got for me? Also, steer clear of those white flowers. <laughs> they seem harmless, but they will fuck your shit up. If you don't believe me, just wait until you come across some of those shambling junkies. Call calls them angels, but they'll tear through you like shit through a goose. So what is this? Uh, Nick Haynes, thank you for the follow. Uh, Hafe? Jaffe? I don't know. Thank you very much for the follow, man. I appreciate it. Baja Blast Mountain Dew. Thank you for the 20 bitties. So what is this over here? They just got like a big old crate full of weed. Am I supposed to set this on fire? Like, why was it marked? What you got? It's good to see the shotguns suck ass in this game and they have no range just like every other game. Why are we never equipped with slugs, man? Skunk hunting. Oh, I'm gonna get me a skunk. I'm gonna get me a skunk. We have a skunk stew, boys! Woohoo! Uh, 10 biddies right there. Q-tip, thank you for the follow as well. Welcome to the community. Where'd that skunk run off to? There he is. Did I get him? God damn, man. That's like Judge Dredd of skunks. Good lord. That skunk is way too good at his job. He got like plus five to skunking. I'm gonna get him, though. I'm gonna get him, though. This skunk will not escape me. Skunk, where'd you go? There you are. There you are, skunk. There he is. I gotta get some. I gotta get close to him. Did I get him? I think I must have. Poor little guy. I got a skunk skin. Got me a skunk skin. Go make a hat out of him. I'm gonna wear that motherfucking skunk on my head. Keep it warm when the Montana chill come out. He's coming right at us! He's coming right at us, Ned! Nah, it's because shotguns are too perfect in real life. They've got range, they've got stopping power. Shotguns are actually a really, really good peak of firearms technology. And if games represented shotguns accurately, like, they would always be the best choice in every game. Like, because shotguns are fucking good, man. What the fuck?! Did he have a grenade launcher? I don't know what just happened. I'm a little confused. Should I stay or should I go? Apparently somebody's either a fan of The Clash or a fan of Stranger Things. Should I stay or should I go now?
<laughs> yeah, that guy's got the real shotgun, unlike us. Should I stay or should I go now? Ba dong bang a bang a bang bong. All right, let's go. We gotta go rescue Ray Ray at the pumpkin farm. We gotta get ourselves a dog. Uh, Crixus, thank you for the follow. Yeah, what's up with the perks? What's going on with perks right now? So we've got human fish. You swim faster and hold your breath longer. <laughs> uh, we got a parachute. What? Okay, I might have to get a grapple. Oh my god. Or I can carry more handgun ammo. That's the pragmatic, intelligent choice. But I want, I want this. I want the parachute. I have to have a parachute. Do 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 do. Should I stay or should I go now? But don't boom the boom the boom boom. Stay or should I go now? But don't boom the boom the boom boom. If I shoot this deer with double, the buckshot there will be trouble. But don't boom the boom the boom boom. All right, we gotta go rescue Ray Ray at the farm. This is important to us. Oh, apparently I completed a challenge. Was that a duck? Did I get him? Congratulations, you completed your first challenge. Complete more challenges to get perk points and get more perks. Oh, okay, so I can catch lake trout. We got chinooks in there. We got pallid sturgeons, paddlefish, all kinds of things up in here. I can skin an eagle? That seems very un-American, bro. That reminds me of that scene in Basketball where he's like, I want to hunt a bald eagle <laughs> for his, his Make-A-Wish Foundation. Like, I don't think you're quite grasping... I don't think you're quite grasping the spirit of the, uh, activity, dude. I want to hunt a bald eagle. <laughs> Alright, BTG Delta. Yeah, they're not bald eagles. I got you. So that gave me another point? Oh, well, I'm gonna take the extra ammo then. Yup, let me get the extra ammo real fast. Oh, that's not good. Yo, that was a laser sight. Oh, I'm gonna get this. What is that, a duck? I'm gonna get this duck. I'm gonna get this duck. That's my duck call right there. My turkey call goes. That's my turkey call right there. You just get on the. Get him, Dougie! Damn, you're terrible at shooting. Well, maybe duck hunting is not my forte. Maybe I'm not good at that. That's what a turkey sounds like. My mom had pet turkeys. It was kind of ridiculous. Oh, I got him! Where'd he go, though? Oh, shit, ain't that always the problem with hunting? Where the hell did that damn thing go? That's a lot of blood, man. It's a little rough over here. Where'd that duck go? I know I got him. Harsh Kane, thank you for that Amazon Prime sub. I appreciate that. Welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite, and thank you for your support, man. Appreciate that a ton. Doesn't look like it's on my map. Little fucker's got to be around here somewhere. I shot him, like, right here. Unless he flew further than expected. Uh, so we got Molotovs and explosives in our weapon wheel. Gotcha. Hold on, I'm hallucinating. Tripping bowels right now. My skunk call? I don't even know what sound a skunk makes. Wait, why do they have a skunk warning sign? Are skunks really that dangerous? This dude thought he was just gonna roll through and not get shot at. Uh, we've got Double X Mayo Man Double X. Thank you very much. 
A pronghorn? Oh, that's different from a deer? It just looked like a deer to me. That looks like some shit you would find in Africa. Running around going all Zamunda and shit in the plains. Yeah, I was gonna say, I feel like skunks would make a fart noise. They'd be like... Pfft. Is this like a gun vendor over here? Because I definitely need to sell some shit. Take that, pronghorn! Aw, oh, he's wounded. I gotta finish him. I gotta finish his ass off. Uh-oh. Well, that missed. God damn it. I was trying to get him with my super secret assassin skills, but it didn't work. Hey, where'd my deer go? I think my deer disappeared, son. Oh, man. Dumbass. The fuck were you thinking? Like, why are you trying to, why are you trying to rush a man with a pistol when you got a club? Oh, fuck. What the fuck? That dude took like eight four fives to the chest. All right, I'm about to lower the difficulty. It's not even that it's hard; it's that I fucking hate how many bullets those guys can take. It's obnoxious. I'm sorry. You just ate like five forty fives to the chest, and you're still up. Shut up, dude. What do you have like PCP for blood? Uh, aiming for the head is terrible marksmanship. Literally no one does that. All shooters in the world are trained to fire center mass. Like, that's why I fire center mass, is because that's how you shoot in real life. Ain't nobody aiming for the T-Box in real life. I'm gonna come back and get this guy. Also, body armor is only good for, like, two shots. Kevlar is compromised the second it stops one bullet. Like, it messes up the weave. And so technically in video games, body armor should really only be good for, like, one shot. They throw out body armor that takes a bullet. What the fuck is this? Oh, this is not going to end well. What are you throwing right now? Oh, you better get... You better get something more useful. What the actual fuck? These dudes have some serious HP on them. Good lord, can I get that flamethrower though? Ooh, I can. Yup, flamethrower. Dude, I got a floppin' Wurfen burger gurger. Did this guy have a- oh, I thought he had a- Finish the job real quick. I got no bullets left though. Where's my floppin' Wurfer? Where's my floppin' Wurfer? There we go. Well, I don't want that one. I want the Floppin' Werfer. There we go. Let's Floppin' Werfer up. Oh, shit. Oh, and this is why Splatty don't fuck- This is why Splatty don't fuck around with explosive weapons or fire weapons. 
Crixus, thank you for the biddies, man. Mustang Lisa, thank you for the biddies as well. Ah, uh, I think the game's outclassing me right now. We're gonna we're gonna show submission. Just so we can make some progress here. I'm impressed though. They did a good job with the difficulty on hard. Like it's nasty. Hard is definitely hard. Can you set fires like in the other Far Cries? Oh shit, I caught the road on fire. I'm pretty good at this. A serrated banana. Thank you for the 10 biddies, man. Alright, let's make some progress here. Let's get something done. Oh shit, son. I think we just caused a national issue. Look, Montana's doing its impression of California. Like, so if I want to craft these... Like, if I want to craft these, how do I craft these? What's up with that? Clicking don't seem to do it. That ain't doing it. I don't know. Do I need a crafting bench or something? Uh, Agaroth, thank you for the resub, man. I appreciate that. 40 months. Jesus, you guys got some long-running subs at this point. Sometimes I forget how long I've been a Twitch streamer, and then I see people resubbing, I'm like, oh my god. Ah! The fuck are you- Asshole! Learn to drive! Yo, this ain't what it looks like. This ain't what it looks like! Do you? Oh, that's gonna hurt. Stick your head out, son. Peek. Oh, shit. I get the feeling that's gonna blow up. Alright, give me a... Give me a different weapon, man. I need something to... There we go. Let me get that. Hey, he tried to run over me with his car first. That was self-defense. He was coming right for me. He reached for something. Uh, Magic Cat has. Yeah, I think Magic Cat's like, there's Magic Cat. And there's another guy who just lurks. Army something, rather, who's got like 40 months. But I don't think I've ever heard him say anything in chat like ever. There are so many roving gangs in this thing. Good lord, man. I'm like terrified to be on a road right now. Uh, I should probably help, seeing as I'm doing the hero thing and whatnot. That's a pretty good shot at that range with a handgun. That's not a bad shot at all, man. People think that handguns are super easy to be accurate with, but past like a certain distance, handguns are kind of tough to aim, because they just don't have the stock and you can't get them like shoulder properly, you know what I mean? Like you can't with other guns. What's up, man? After the shit went down, I heard Merle took his truck over to Silver Lake Trailer Park. Dude can hold his own in a fight, but I'm worried he's gonna get in over his head. Apparently, we've got Merle Briggs. If there's one thing I know about being in the middle of the, uh, the middle of the back country, I'm gonna use a diplomatic term here. Uh, you definitely need to be friends with somebody named Merle. That's the only way you're gonna make it. Ooh. Ooh. Come here, cultists. Splatty's got a surprise for you. Cultists. Ooh. Cultists. It's just your best friend, Splatty. Get 
get some! That was awesome. I don't know if we're on a 50 or a 30 right now, but either way, I feel pretty happy with it. We're all up on the bitch. Just letting people know. Hey, man, did you see how I killed that guy? With that big gun over there? What's up, man? You mind if I take... I'm gonna take this over here. Just don't worry about it. Doop -a doop 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 do. Taking your wife somewhere else. Doop do doop -a doop 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 do. She just needs some shade, man. You can't leave a dead body in the sun. It'll start to smell. <gasps> Incoming! I guess I'll stay on point here. We gotta go rescue a dog. I keep forgetting about it. Can I detach that thing like fucking Rambo and walk around as being a badass? I feel like I should be allowed to do that. Can I pick up the door and use it as like a riot shield? No. Nobody ever likes my ideas. Why does it sound like the entire world is like at war right now? Like, why are people on the roads if this is going on? Just hide in your fucking house. Yo, is that a plane? <gasps> Hold up. There's a grapple point nearby. Get the grapple to use it. I don't care about that. Let's go ride in this plane real fast. Flat filet of anchovies. Thank you very much. Done. And that is how Splatty perpetrates violence. How does he know they're friendly, man? Like, the reticle lights up a certain color, but how does the character himself know that these people on the road are friendly? Hold on, though. There's a plane. What if we can get to the mission faster if we have a plane? Well, that's not good. Ooh, I did a good thing. Yay! Help me, please. I already did, man. Back in the day, the Beauchamp clan used to throw these crazy barbecues at the Moonflower trailer park. All there is now is Sharky and his crazy contraption he's rigged up to fight the cult. Sharky Boshaw. That's a that's a hell of a woodland name. Good old Sharky Boshaw went on down to the river to find himself a catfish, and well, Sharky doesn't done make it none. <gasps> I can fly the plane? How do I fly a plane? I don't know what I'm doing right now. So accelerate. Oh shit. We gotta go. Oh this is a terrible idea, and I have no idea what I'm doing. To the sky! Will it stall? I don't think it'll stall. That'd be a little flight simulator-y. I do have a parachute. We don't land planes. We do this thing like Just Cause. What's up, Tao? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. 
How high up can we fly? I'm curious. Oh, you can stall the plane. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, shit. That probably gave away our stealthy, uh... Apparently, you can stall the plane. Interesting. A cult outpost is liberated. You'll gain access to missions and shops. Cult outposts can have three alarms. If you get detected before disabling them, enemy reinforcements will be called. Liberating a cult outpost undetected gives you money. Yeah, good luck with that. Uh, Lyle, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Nerd Castle, man. I appreciate that. Welcome to the community. It's great to have you. Something tells me I should have parachuted a little sooner. Or, I'm sorry, a little later. This has taken a while. Oh, the dog's over there? I thought the dog was over here. Well, shit. Nobody noticed my massive parachute. Don't worry about it. I don't have any stealth weapons with me, so this might get interesting. Got that generic Christian pop rocking. So I need to disable the alarm before, like, anything else. Where was the, uh... The alarm tower's out front? Fuck. All right, well, this dude looks like number one. He's reasonably isolated. Oh, cool. He interacts with the box. Ooh. Kick that fool's throat in. All right. So disable the alarm. Hold on, you gotta give me a second. I gotta disable this alarm. Alright, so the alarms are disabled. We're good there. Let's go up inside of here. I'm killing Americans because they have a different religion that I don't believe in. It's the American way. <laughs> Yo, is that a fucking bear inside that cage? I'm doing I'm doing George Washington's work right now. Thomas Jefferson would endorse this wholeheartedly. This whole county was left to rot. We'll fix it up as best we can before it's too late. I'm good at opening doors quietly. Oh. I am gonna mullitate that guy. 
Wait, I got a throwing knife? I'm not really in the- How did that guy not fucking see me? How did he not see me? These guys have- these guys have glaucoma or something. They need help. <laughs> Alright, so now we just got the dude on the roof that needs to be dealt with, I think. That bear doesn't seem very friendly. Who wants to stick their hand in and pet him? Huh? Who's got the bravery? Let's play a little game of pet the bear. I'll have you know that's a very different sport in San Francisco, though. Be careful about those uh, organized games of pet the bear in San Francisco. It might not turn out the way you think. Come on. Hey, what's up, Ninja? How you doing? And down he goes. So there must be somebody left. Oh. Okay. He's over there poking and prod- Was that a revolver? Ooh. Yeah, I can fuck with a revolver. Let's play around with the 357. Yup. How bad is fall damage? Not that bad. Now the only thing that could go wrong here is if there's somebody on the left. But if there's nobody on the left, man, this guy got like a holy symbol. He's out here like Deus Wolt. Oh well. He's done for now. Bye bye. Uh for now, Chaos, as you upgrade, um as you upgrade, you get more guns you can carry around with you. Well, that went pretty well. It's a good thing you guys believed in me, though, because I was just going to go in hot. The collapse is upon us. John wants to pack as much of the bliss-infused fertilizer as we can into the silo. Be careful about how you handle it. It's very explosive. Together, we will march to Eden's Gate. Okay. So... Let me reload this thing. Oh good, he's got a speed loader. That's good, although he's pretty good with that speed loader. Speed loaders don't work like that in real life. Like, speed loaders, there's at least a little bit of like, yeah, to get it in there. Like, in video games, they're always just like, jump, in, go, shoot. And I'm like, mm. My speed loader's kind of wobbly, though. Like, my speed loader works, but I don't know if I would trust it in combat. I ain't never seen bears like this before. All this ripe fruit is attracting bears. Under normal circumstances, we try and catch them and release them somewhere safer. Yeah, right. These bears got into some of that bliss crap the cult had stored out back. It's making them act all crazy. It's too dangerous to catch them. We gotta put them down. Uh, Ben Ben, thank you very much for the follow. Appreciate that. Catch a bear. Ain't nobody catching bears. They go out and they have bear hunting season. There's a difference. Uh, shops are available to buy and sell and customize your weapons. Yeah, let's do it. What kind of money I got going on right now? Oh my good sweet lord. I can sell my loot. Alright, let's sell off some loot here. So it's 180 bucks for a pronghorn skin. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Yeah, let me get 550 bucks. Yup, and then we got some deer skins in there. Bruh, sell the stack. Go for it. Oh, I only have one. Okay. I don't want to sell my map though. I feel like I might need that. We can buy silver bars. What do silver bars do? Oh, it's their microtransaction bullshit that's in every video game now. Good. Can't have a video game without that. Yo.
Man, we can be up in here like a fucking operator. We can be out here rocking that scroll. Alright, I don't want to spend money on that right now, but... Are there any dope hats I can get? What kind of dope-ass hats are there? Oh, uh, we got aviators, though? Ooh, I might have to make a poor decision now. I might have to make a real bad decision. Yeah, that's a pretty American gun right there. That gun is, uh, American as fuck. I can customize my baseball bat? What? <laughs> no, don't purchase that. That's dumb. Don't buy that. So, like, is there anything? Oh, I can put scopes on? Ooh, a suppressor? Yeah, I kind of want a suppressor. Ooh, okay, what can I do with the... Nope, what can I do with the rifle, then? Like, let's say that I got a... What can I do with that? Wandering Cub, thank you very much for the sub, man. I appreciate that. Welcome to the Nerdcastle Elite. Uh, very much appreciate that. That's a tier two sub. One of them big baller subs. I just want to customize it. So it looks like I can get a reflex sight on it, which probably help out. A silencer would be pretty dope, too. How much money do I have? Can I get both? I think a 2x would do me better, though. Extremely increases max. Do you have, like, a number, though? Like, 2x, 4x, 8x? Like, I need a number, because a 2x would be pretty universally useful. Hey, what's up, Takias? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. That's probably a 2. That's probably a 4. And that's probably the 8 right there or something. I'll probably go for this one. And then, like, fucking of course we gotta put a silencer on it. I'm gonna go with the circle one because it makes me happier. Ah, that's just like an ACOG or whatever. Oh well. Better than nothing, I guess. Ooh. Can I swap this thing over to single fire mode? I don't like the way it's always stuck on. Does anybody have to know if there's a change fire mode key? Where I can like swap it over to single shot? Because I don't like using things on full automatic unless I'm like point blank. There it is. Thank you. Appreciate that. Much better. Oh my god. Way better. Alright. We're solid now. So where was that doggo at? We gotta go rescue our dog real fast so we can be like the real John Wick except our dog won't die. Are you telling me I can blow that thing up? Because if you're telling me I can blow that thing up, I'm pretty excited about it. I think I'm entirely... We found Jimson's weed. Why is Jimson always leaving his weed in weird spots? Hello? Anyone here want to get shot? That was the shot that I wanted to make. That made me pretty happy. What's going on over here? I hear the sound of, like, contemporary Christian music. <laughs> Alright, so we got one right there, two right there, okay. So we got one guy that'll run for the alarm. Uh, Captain 
Captain PB Crunch, thank you very much for that follow. Dude, I love peanut butter crunch. It's so good. And then Jacob, thank you for the follow as well. Welcome to the community, everybody. It's great to have you. So I'm assuming I probably want to rescue that guy. That guy's got an alarm, though, so we're going to have to be careful about how we do this. Uh, Nebulous, thank you very much for the tier 2 sub right there. Welcome to the Nerdcastle Elite. You guys just spoiling Splatty today. Spoiling that Splatty. Spoiling, spoiling that Splatty. But seeing as I am a Splatty, I kind of... I, I'm a little biased. Uh, Horse Hopper, thank you for the 10 biddies. I appreciate that. Can I go down in this bunker? Operator. Commando raid engaged. Tango's found. Eliminating target. Uh oh, he's on the other side of the wall. Well, he's dead as fuck now. Alright, let's loot the house. Is there a way for me to shut this fucking noise off, man? I, my family's super religious, and I've had more than enough contemporary Christian pop in my life. I've had way too much. Uh, Hell's Army, thanks for the resub, man. Nine months right there. Got him. Uh, we got Russell. Read this. Eden's Gate has been hounding me for our land ever since you left. Then the other day, some of them came to the house and told us we've been marked. They said that Ryan was going to get taken to their project, and that Boomer was going to be given to a fella named Jacob up north. Look, I know we got our differences, but you've left me to be the only one looking out for our boy, and I've noticed that I'm stand or I've decided that I'm standing my ground. There's no way I'm letting these bastards break up our family. Whatever happens, I hope you understand. I'm thinking Ray Ray didn't make it. Ooh, free medkit though. Oh, never mind. Yep, they definitely didn't make it. I don't see anything out back that looks interesting. Seagull God, thank you very much for the follow, dude. Welcome on back in. Yeah, throughout the course of the game, if you use an unsilenced rifle, your ears just go, Wee! Your tinnitus gets worse and worse and worse. Hey, 59 bucks. Yup. I'm not trying to be an asshole or anything, but they're dead. They're not going to need it. Ain't no need for the money in the devil's country. Ryan, if you're reading this, then you followed Mommy's plan just like we practiced. That's my boy. Now take these supplies and head for the woods. And remember, if Mommy doesn't show up after three hours, head south and don't look back. Don't forget to switch the safety on the gun to off. It's very important. Thank you and love you to pieces. Mom, I don't think he got the gun. I don't think that little kid made it. Yeah, I don't know who can listen to this shit. This seems like the kind of music that people that like randomly close their eyes and put their hands like this listen to. Like, this shit is obnoxious music. It really is terrible. You know what? Let's put a- let's put a stop to this right now. There we go. All better. Puppy, would you like to be free? The dog's a champion. Send it to our stronghold across the street. And have it shipped north. We'll let my brother decide how strong it really is. They're gonna dogfight him? Well, I definitely don't support that, but how the fuck do we get him out of there? It doesn't look like there's a... Oh, he's been dookieing everywhere. I... Apparently, I can break chains with my foot. What's up, buddy? What's going on, pal? Little cattle dog. You want to come with me? Specialists are guns for hire or fangs for hire after completing their missions. They are far more powerful and their abilities are available at the start. Each specialist can be upgraded to the perks menu to decrease their cooldown. Hold on, you're with me now, homie. Yikes. Can you 
We gotta get you a good collar, though. That collar sucks, bro. Oh, like fuck you did. Yeah, get him, Boomer! Get him, Boomer! Take that fool out! Fuck him up! That's how we do it, see? Boomer's got my back right now. That's why you need a doggo. That's why I got an Akita. Because she be on a motherfucker. My Akita just looking at you when you're a newcomer like, What's up? What's going on, Essay? What you doing? What you trying to fuck around with, way? Cougar? Where's a cougar? Oh, fuck. I can't see it. I got no visual. I don't think that lady's gonna make it. I'll save you, lady. I'll save you. I owe you, bud. Why is she in conflict? I don't see nothing. Oh, like there he dog. is. How'd that cougar take so many bullets? Jesus. Uh, Thumper, thank you very much for the follow, man. Welcome to the community. It's good to have you. I think it was just the cougar was going to attack or something. I don't know. How does one bullet to the dome not kill a deer? Like, I know normally you shoot them right below the shoulder so you get the heart or whatever and it snaps the spine with the impact of the bullet so they die quick. But like... Oh shit. Go get him, Boomer. Oh, never mind. Sorry. I stole your job, Boomer. Well, sorry, lady. I don't even know where you came from, though. Uh, you got a shotgun. Alright, well, I just gotta get some more bullets lined up. What do we have on our map now? Let's see what's going on. Uh, it looks like we have a... Yeah, I already liberated that place, so we're good to go over there. Uh, there's bear necessities. A group of bears are causing trouble in the orchard. Go and kill them. Alright, let's go fight some fucking bears. Why not? This seems like a terrible goddamn plan considering bears have like bulletproof skulls and shit. A turkey? How is that turkey still alive? You must be out of your goddamn mind. Oh yeah, the bunker. Let's go see what's going on with the bunker. He tried to kick me too. Turkeys do that, man. Turkeys fight. They bloody each other up. My mom had a herd of turkeys. Like with the poults and the toms and everything else. Like 30 or 40 of them that lived on their land. And my mom learned to hand feed them and everything. And you could pet them and whatnot. But fuck, man. In mating season, those males fight. They tear each other up. They kill each other sometimes too. I'm going to assume that on the deers and shit... There's like no hit zone because when you catch them in the head like that, it seems like they're still perfectly fucking fine. Yeah, turkeys are, the toms especially, the males are pretty rough during breeding season. They go pretty hard in the paint. What are you guys doing back here, Heisenberg? Mm hmm. I know what happens out in the backcountry. People cook meth. That's what happens. A new object revealed the Vietnam lighter. What's a Vietnam lighter? Never heard that before. Fasteners, prairie fire, rifle ammo, hell yeah. A little bit of cash money Skrilla. Some arrows that we can't even use. Big old supply of toilet paper because obviously you gotta wipe your ass. 
You can't have everybody walking around the bunker with poo butt stinking the place up. I still have no idea how to craft. Like, I assume I do it somewhere, but I ain't seen it so far. Oh, it looks like right click on. Oh, you can't make a grenade, but you can make. Oh, you can make Molotovs. Only some stuff can be crafted. Gotcha. That makes sense. All right. Let's get up out of here, doggo. Come along, my faithful hound. Let us go find things to murder. all you, buddy. Nope, I won't. I have a release command, but I'm not going to waste it on you. Sorry, man. Sorry, no sorry. Oh, yeah, I did get a perk, didn't I? I got a couple of them, actually, I think. Uh, yeah, I got three perk points right now. So we got a special ammo bag. I've got the journey pack so I can carry more items. Uh, we've got the throwables bag so I can have more grenades. Boomer comes back faster after he's wounded. What other things do we have in here? Nimble fingers so I can turn those so I can turn off alarms faster. Primal mastery. You can reload, aim, switch bows and slingshots faster. Do we get a wrist rocket? No way. What is that? Heavy weapons mastery. There's the wingsuit. Oh, I want it so badly. I want it so badly. Apparently, I can go fishing at some point, too. I just don't know when I can go fishing. It looks like I need four points for all the extra stuff that's over on the right. Yeah, I'm going to need a few more points. I really want the additional holster so I can carry around extra guns with me. So I think I'll probably do that. I don't have the 980 anymore. I think my shit's out. My shit's outdated down below. A key, a Garden View key. It bugs me that I can't shoot out the TVs. Note to all pickers: the bears are back this year. Remember the rules: pick with a buddy, clean up any food and trash, stay safe. Yep, we're about to go handle this bear problem. Let's go. Look for the bear necessities. The simple bear necessities. Forget about your worries and your strife. Boo, ba doop, boop. We got them bear necessities, those simple bears that need to be. We're gonna shoot some bears today for life. Jesus. That bear went straight ham bone on that guy. That guy had a fucking terrible day. Good lord. I will get that black bear though. So like, we just wasted all of our ammo killing that bear. Um... Fighters or civilians that are available to be hired. Yes, you come with me. Come with me right now. Wait, did that get rid of my dog or do I still have my dog? Open the roster to replace your assigned gun with hire with your new one. Oh, so you can only have like one. Oh, no, never mind. You get fighters down here. I don't know where my other fighter went, but he like vanished. Yeah, I don't know where he's at. He's should be here somewhere. Acquire the leadership perk to unlock the second squad in single player mode. Okay. Uh, AJ or Aja Squared, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream or Aja Squared. Uh, welcome to the stream. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome on back in. And then Aiden Beast, thank you for joining the community. Welcome. It's good to have you. For anybody else that's interested in getting notifications whenever I go live, you can do that by following the stream on the button that's up there. And then if you wanted to get my... Uh, if you wanted to get my streaming schedule for the week, you can go to twitter.com slash splattercatgames where I post that. I need some more ammo. Is there like an ammo crate around here somewhere or something? I need that pretty badly. There's an ammo box. That's what I'm talking about. Is there another one around here? It looked like I could go in through the window on the roof too when I was up there. Uh, Sensora, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. There's a big crate up here that I missed. What's inside of you? More rifle ammo? That's pretty much what I was looking for, so that sounds good. 
Was there anything up on this little catwalk? Ooh, on the catwalk? Nope. Nothing on the catwalk. Uh, Tomcat, you get it from the vendor. Uh, if you liberate an outpost or something like that, it'll unlock a vendor for you. And then you go to the vendor, and if you right-click on the gun that you want to upgrade, uh, you can upgrade guns, you can add scopes, you can add, like, tactical modifications and stuff like that. I'm hoping that I end up with a grenade launcher on this bitch at some point. Alright, bear, where are you at? I'm so rumbly in my tumbly. Where are you? I know you're out here, Pooh Bear. That's right, get shot in the dome, son. Oh. That one took a lot less bullets than the last one. Maybe it's because it was in the middle of an animation, like murdering somebody. Where's the last one at? Yeah, we got attacked by a bear. I would agree that's pretty intense. Oh no! Shoot it! Fucking shoot it! Hell yeah, losers weepers, son. So apparently this bear's been eating people non-stop. Dude, I am tripping fucking balls right now. This looks like that drug that was in Judge Dredd. I forget what it was called, but the one that makes time slow down and then they throw you off the top of the tower. I forget the name of the drug. What the? Slow mo, thank you. I think with the bears, you just gotta make sure you shoot them in the head. That seems to be the big weak point. Although I thought with bears, you weren't supposed to aim at the head because their heads can actually block bullets. Like, I heard that bear skulls are thick as fuck. So you're supposed to, like, aim for the fucking, like, lower shoulder to get their heart or whatever. But I don't know. I never hunted a bear before. My buddy got a bear, like, ten years ago when he was out hunting for something, rather. A bear rushed him when he was in the woods and he killed it. Yeah, I heard they got bulletproof skulls, like, 387, I'm sorry, not 387s, 357s, and shit will just bounce right off. Uh, Chakras and Reflectra, thank you very much for the follows. Welcome to the Nerd Castle, it's great to have you. I mean, it was a black bear, it wasn't like a huge bear. I mean, he, he makes it out like it was the biggest bear in the country, but it's a, it's a black bear, he's got it mounted on the wall now. Man, this game's just getting me copyrighted left and right. Man, gonna make it. See, now I got squad. How do I reload my ammo? There we go. That's what I need. I can beef up my armor a little bit. I can buy some med kits. Grenades would be nice. But, like, how do I buy, like, default ammo? That's all that I want. I don't want, like, anything special. Like, I don't want APs or anything. I just want normal bullets. There we go. I saw that ammo before I saw that ammo on the left. You'll have to forgive me. And if you don't, well, fine then. I do have skins. Yup, let's get paid. Really, a bear skin wasn't worth nearly as much as I thought it was going to be worth. That's surprising to me. 180 bucks for a bear skin? I feel like a bear skin command way higher cost than that. Like a way higher one. Then again, we're selling feathers for $100, so something tells me that the economy's a little fucked up here. Either way, we got money for... No, don't sell that. I got money for upgrades, though. Yeah, I was gonna say, for my buddy, he had to send the bear to Russia to get it taxidermied. And, like, it cost a fucking fortune. And after it was taxidermied, he could have sold it for way more than that, but he kept it as a trophy and put it on his wall above his mantelpiece. And so, like, I don't know, man. I can get a Mac Billy? What? I need one bad. Sapphire Coco Pelly, thank you very much for that sub. For some reason, saying your name makes me very, very happy, and I appreciate that. Ooh, a 226? Okay, got like a little SIG right there. 
1911, got the Sig, got the Scorpion. Ugh. Oh shit! You know what I have? You know I have to have the Tech Nine. You know I have to have the Tech Nine because we're gangster up here at the Nerd Castle. Ooh, that's pretty baller though. That's a baller ass pistol right there. That's not a gun you shoot. That's a gun you show though. That's true. We did shoot the shit out of that bear's hide. It's probably not a very good hide. What can you do to upgrade this guy right here? Put some hunting scopes on it and shit. The coal case. You're telling me that you don't have a gold-plated version of this gun? You disappoint me right now. I got a 38 Special. This got gold action on it. All the action, all the screws on it are gold. And then it's got the pistol grip, this fucking pearl. It's all chromed out, dude. I fucking love my 38 special. It's such a baller gun. It's a gun that balls hard. I've also, I've got a fucking, I've got a redwood handle for it too. But I keep the pearl grips on it. Because I ball out. Yeah, 44 Snubby. I don't think that'd be a very fun gun to shoot. I agree with you. Uh, Thumper, thank you for that sub. Welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite. You know, I kind of want, uh... I, I kind of want the... I kind of want the MAC-10, man. I kind of want the MAC-10. Oh, uh, it's got yellow, but it doesn't have gold. I want mustard? It's not a fucking hot dog, it's a gun. Oh, shit. Oh, some gangster shit going on. All the stuff that you buy with the silver bars, you can buy with normal currency. It's just the silver bars are a shortcut for people that are lazy and they want to get it like right now or whatever. Or people that just have a lot of cash and don't give a fuck. Maybe the Vietnam lighter was a sellable item. I like it, it a lot, solid. but I love Far Cry. I like Far Cry 2, 3, and 4, so... You know, I, I never had any doubt that I was going to enjoy this game. Are those vultures? Dude, I'm hunting vultures right now with a Mac 10. That's what's up. A Mac 11. What the dead don't need. I'm glad you like it, Thumper. Really, really happy about it. Dude, in every video game, I gold plate all of my guns because I like to ball out. Like, if I could get a gold plated AK like tomorrow, I would buy one in a heartbeat and I would just put it on the wall behind me on my stream. I would change my desk configuration so that I had a wall to put it on so people would be like, damn, Splatty got a gold plated AK. Like, like an African warlord, cuz. You know how it goes. We bang out here, Cuddy. It's a fucking wolf! Eat dicks! I just got bit by a fucking wolf. Finders keepers. Uh, Zerneris, thank you for the Twitch Prime, man. I just got bit by a wolf, so I'm a little bit addled right now. That's my battle cry. I go, ah! And then I scream, eat dicks, and I unload my entire magazine. Uh, blood is great. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Nerdcastle community. It's great to have you. Hey, what's going on, Chaotic? We've been up for about two and a half hours right now. Uh, Dante's Plague. Welcome to the Blue Man Crew. You're blue. Da -ba -dee -da -ba -da -da -ba -dee -da -ba -da Where was this bunker at? It's kind of dark over here. I need that Vietnam lighter, though. I think it's a sellable. Oh, I walked right past that shit. Yeah, it's a collectible lighter. Okay. Woody's lighter. All right. Yeah, I just started off like two hours ago. We're in here liberating people. I need to find another plane, though. That was definitely the fastest way to get around. Just take it to wherever you want to go, then crash it. Uh, what else is going on over here? We got Merle Briggs. That's a serial killer name, man. That's a fucking devil name. Like, if your first name is like Howard or George or whatever, and then your last name is a single syllable with a hard consonant, you definitely a serial killer. Like Scruggs. Like, if your name was like Howard Scruggs, he's definitely killed some people. They're in his basement right now. I see a plant over here. I see the possibility of weed. Let's go grab it. 
You know what people out in the country doing. They definitely growing weed. Ain't none of those people want it legalized because that keeps the prices up. But then again, like, fucking, I still buy from a dealer. I'll be honest from you. Like, I'm sorry, but you can't get a $40 ounce from a fucking dispensary. Like, I can get, like, a top shelf primo ounce for, like, 80 bucks. You go to the dispensary and get that same O, it's going to be, like, 180 it's just like, fuck dispensaries, dude. They're too expensive. I ain't doing that noise. Yeah, dude. It's California. Everybody's growing out here. You get some of that Primo Humboldt shit. Some of that Lemon Kush from up north. Woo! It'll be a little twiggy. It'll be a little twiggy and a little seedy. But, yo. It'll be cheap and it'll get you domed. Yeah, there's a lot of ticks. You can definitely, I gotta pick ticks off the dogs and I gotta pick ticks off the cats all the time. There's a lot of ticks out here, little deer ticks, little red ones. I mean, it's basically, it's just shifted the economy where I live. Like, you go to the dealer still because it's too expensive, the dispensary. Like, only rich kids go to the dispensary, man. It's too expensive. Used to sleep like, some people treat it like it's like a baller thing. They're like, yo, I buy my weed at the store like a G. But I'm just like, eh. I buy my weed for 60 and 0, so. And it's still Blue Dream. Like, it's still Sour Diesel. Same fucking shit you're getting at the dispensary from the same fucking place. Only difference? Ba bow. Tax free, son. All right, so what we got going on over here? Making a move. You set up on that side. Please don't give us away. If you do, I'm going to be so upset with you. All right, you take that one. Or, you know, I'll just be a glory hog and I'll take it. Is that all of them? What else we got going on down here? It feels weird to murder people to contemporary Christian music. I'm calling- it's not Christian music, but I'm saying it sounds like the stuff you would hear on like K-Love or some shit. that gun please Thanks, deputy. Like what is it with them and just like having speakers everywhere playing annoying music our sorry asses I don't think we're rescuing any Americans here I'm pretty sure we're rescuing Canadians is there like a Canadian commune in Montana that I don't know about because everybody in here has a Canadian accent Every single person in this game so far has had a Canadian accent. Everybody in this game has been like, oot, a boot, outside. Hello, deputy. Uh, Dante's Plague, thank you for the 500 bit, 1,000 biddies, thank you for that, I appreciate it. But, like, it keeps breaking me out of the immersion because, like, I'm in Montana, so I expect people to be kind of rural and have kind of a drawl or, you know, whatever. And then all of a sudden, like, they're like, thanks for helping us out. And, like, you're like, oh, God, he's Canadian. There's nothing wrong with being Canadian. I'm just saying, like, it's supposed to take place in Montana, so it's a little immersion breaking. Maybe there's a lot of Canadians in Montana. I don't know. I've never been to Montana. People in Montana are strapped up, though. No lie. You guys got the good guns out here. Man. Fucking people in Montana. They got the good shit you can't get out here in California. They got the fun shit. They got that 4th of July shit. Uh, Mr. Harris Maverick and Cynical Cyanide, thank you for the follows. Welcome to the Nerd Castle. It's great to have you. They got fucking straps hidden everywhere in here. Is that a shotgun? Okay. 
I ain't never been to Montana. I've been to California. I've been to Washington. I've been to Nevada, Arizona. I've been to Mexico, Jamaica. I've been to Massachusetts. But I had never been up to like the north central part of the country. Like I don't know what there would be to do other than hike if you go like on a vacation to Montana. Like horseback ride and hike maybe? That's pretty much it. Yo, who's hollering over here? Getting a better angle. Yo! Were you besmirching this lady's virtue? Man, cultist, what's gotten into you? Doing the Lord's work right now. How you doing? Living out here has taught me anything. Split her to nine months now. Oh, we have an official Twitch baby. Do we? Man, official Twitch baby. I'm sure the children have been conceived during my tenure here on Twitch TV. Hopefully not with me on in the background or anything like that. If y'all are fucking with me in the background as noise, stop. I don't like that. That makes me feel awkward. Don't do that. Or at the bare minimum, don't tell me about it. I don't need to know. Like, I know I got that sensual voice. And I like, I ooze sexuality. Ooh. Yeah, somebody's Mustang about to get stole. I'll tell you that much. Is it actually a PVG Malon? Or a Pygmalion? Hmm. That's a sexy vehicle right there. I mean, you drive it more than five feet, it's going to break down, but it's a sexy vehicle. My dad's a big Mustang guy. Not like modern Mustangs, but 60s Mustangs. I think my chat's broken. Give me a second. Hold on. There's no way that I made that comment about fucking with me in the background and nobody said anything in chat. That's how I know it's broken right now. I know for a fact it's broken. There it goes. Yep, it was totally, uh, it was to- Man, Chaotic Blue, stop fucking with me in the background, man! Oh, I don't know, get you some baby-making music, some- Me, me, baby, I got some questions, you enjoy being hurt, I know you smell the perfume, Looks like the we makeup owe you on one. a shirt, I don't like this being tied up shit, looks like we owe you one. Uh, Etnis, thank you very much for the follow. Thanks for saving the day here, kid. Name's Merle. Merle Briggs. These sons of bitches are making me regret the day I eased up on their- You guys are killing me right now. You guys are killing me. I fucking knew this would happen. I am not baby making Doesn't content. Make a difference now. All I know is we got people to protect. I know how to get back at the cult. But if we're gonna do it right, we need the Death Wish. That's my truck. Hold up, the is, Death Wish? It's sitting in a garage that's been overrun by those fucks. You head over to US Auto and get it. I'll make sure the folks here are safe. I'll meet you there and we'll go on a rampage against those ass wipes. You got some sort of Death Wish? Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Uh, I'll be, I gotta pay solid child support because you will, that's what you get. That's Splatty's Revenge. Dead. What happens if I shoot this dude in his fucking head? My bad. I didn't think I was going to be allowed to do that. Like most games don't let you do that shit. <laughs> it's got to be like a big old fucking... It's got to be a... It's got to be a big old fucking truck nuts ass F-350 like lifted with the fucking light bar on the top and everything else and it's got like a shovel on the front. That's what it's got. It's got the scoop. It's gotta be. That has to be what it is. Alright, let me take a piss real fast. We've been going for about three hours and I gotta, I gotta take a leak. You guys give me a second. Thank you for stopping in on the stream. If while I'm away you enjoy Chernabog, uh, throw a follow at me. Follow button's right up there. That's how you get notifications whenever I go live. I'm gonna be playing this game a lot. I would love to have you. I'm a variety streamer trying to grow this thing on up and go full time. And, you know, every single person helps, and I love your company. So anyways, I'll see you in 30 seconds. I'm going to grab a drink, and I'm going to take a piss, and I'll be right back.
I brought back Tuxedo Mix, too. I brought back Tuxedo Mix. Because who doesn't love Tuxedo Mix, man? It's got the yogurt. It's got the yogurt raisins and the chocolate raisins. And then it's got fucking chocolate peanuts in it, man. It's not good for your diet. It's not good for your waistline. But boy, is it good. Everybody loves Tuxedo Mix. Sometimes I call it black and white. I call it tuxedo mix. That's what we called it when I was a kid. Yeah, it's a type of trail mix. There it is right there. It's basically lots of yogurt covered stuff, lots of chocolate covered stuff, peanuts and raisins. find an activity. Claggett Bay. Go down to Langford. Is there like a way for me to scout the map and figure out what activities are available or do I just have to like run around? Ooh, there's an aviation place down there. Let's go see what's going on with Skylar. It's a bit of a walk, there's but a way, a we got a car. Wow. Uh, can I, like, change the radio station? There we go. Enemy sighted! Fuck that. Off-road! Oh, we ran out of road. I don't think we're gonna be able to dig it out of this ditch. And I gotta cross a river, so... I go walking in the, in the middle of the, I go walking in the, in the middle of the, I go walking in the, in the middle of the, I go walking in the, in the middle of the. Uh, Gunners, thank you for the biddies, man. I appreciate that. And then, Jub, welcome to the Nerdcastle community. Good to have you. Do I hear a boar? I feel like I hear a boar. Alright. I don't know exactly, like, they gave me a little press release thing for this game, and they were like, you should go to every zone and just do a whole bunch of stuff. And just kind of see how it goes. Are they, like, under attack? Ow, sliding on concrete seems like a terrible idea. Let's never do that again. Oh, is that dude on the 50? Yeah, don't let that happen. Couldn't tell if that was bushes or a little hill right there, so I decided to fire on through. What else we got around here? There it is. We'd all starve if it was up to the cult. I don't know how to hunt your own food. Are we like done here? Like, do we have anything to worry about? Gotta take what the dead don't need. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about, man. That is what I'm fucking talking about. Oh good, the sun will come out. Ugh. Why is that guy trying to fight me wearing like an old 1800s coat? It's a man with a sense of style. I respect that. <laughs> like, what did you expect to happen? I'm sitting here, sacrifice! Sacrifice! 3D Pixels! Thank you very much for the five biddies. Uh, 
Moss, thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate that. Hunt your own food. If you're buying, I'm selling. All right. You got the look of a hunter in your eye. That's good. The way things are going, you got to be able to fend for yourself. This fucking cult. Everyone rolled their eyes when they talked about the end of the world. But look around. That's what be true. Rule of law is dead and gone. Nobody protecting us anymore, so we gotta do it ourselves. Only thing that matters is staying alive and staying fed. Now, I got a few things for sale if you're interested. Ammo, gear, useful stuff in times like these. And if you got any animal skins, I'll pay good money for them. Saves me time from going out myself. World's a dangerous place now. If you see any of those fucking Peggies, you put them down without a second thought. Peggies? Why are they called Peggies? I don't know. Hey, that skunk tried to rush us, man. From Arizona. Heartless. Uh, thanks for the biddies. Daydream Kitten, thanks for the bits as well. Colby Carlson, thank you for the resub. Welcome on back from... Arizona. I almost said Florida for some reason, even though I was reading the word Arizona. I don't know why. Apparently I got Florida on the brain right now. Bunch of bullets and shit in here. The park is closed. Whitetail is closed till further notice. If you have any questions or need to report an incident, phone the local ranger station at 555-1212. Alright. I'm still curious how I get to fishing. Like, do I have to buy a fishing rod or something? Get him? Nope, he's still up. Man, that little fucker's got wheels on him. He's quick. Wolf of the Past, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream. Uh, Satish, welcome to the Nerdcastle Elite, and thank you for that subscription. Uh, I will use your sub to guide me forward as a boar hunter. I dedicate this boar to you. There you go. Satish, that was your boar right there. Uh, Josh Jams, thank you for the follow. Man, I'd be worried about hunting boar, man. I don't fuck around with boars. Boars are... Boars are sketchy. Like, I, I don't want a shovel. I want my aluminum bat back. Thank you. Like, boars are hella sketchy, man. Like, I just... Mm, I don't need to tempt fate like that. I just don't. I just don't need to tempt fate like that. Like, it looked like there's a fishing spot right there. I just don't know how you fish. Maybe we do it from that chair. Or maybe not. Yeah, 30,000. Wait, how many bits was that? Let me go back. Let me go back. I missed it. Uh, 3,000 bits right there from Valhalla Axeman. I appreciate that. It hasn't popped up for whatever reason on the overlay just yet. But it will eventually. It'll catch up. Uh, Thantos, my favorite pie? Pecan? I think? I like pecan pie a lot. My mom used to make fresh pecan pie. Because we lived next to an almond, pecan, and peach orchard. Man. Pecan pie, man. Ain't nothing make me feel like I'm at home like pecan pie. Taking someone else's junk and turning it into something. Else. Let's go talk to the vendor. See if maybe she's got something like that. Is that a fucking buffalo? So, uh. I, I really kind of feel like we're witnessing some real backcountry hood shit right now. Ooh! Kama Ninja, thank you very much for the sub, man. I appreciate that. Welcome on into the Nerd Castle Elite. Glad you got it. Yeah, come here a sec. 
You're holding a baseball bat. I don't know if I want to. My goddamn boyfriend has my fishing rod and won't give it back. Help me get it back, would you? You're packing, right? Shoot a couple holes in his stuff, scare the shit out of him. Uh. Put some lead in the satellite dish. All right, so gentlemen, don't date this girl. That's my advice for you. I've dated this girl before. That girl that's going to take a fucking baseball bat to your car when she gets mad at you. That girl that might pull a knife on you. I fucking dated that girl. Don't fucking date that girl. Let her be alone forever. Let her be alone and miserable. You don't need that in your life. Just let her go her separate way and walk off into the forest never to be seen again. That girl is terrifying. Like, yeah, it's weirdly sexy in like a weird way, but your life is going to be fucking miserable. Don't do it. Like, as a, as a guy, I feel like I can't disrespect another man's keg. Like, that's just, if he went and got a keg, this is a man with fine appreciation for beer. Like, we should be sharing and being friends right now. I should shoot her and help him. Oh, oh why we shoot up the septic tank, bro? For real, I just feel bad for this guy. Like, what did he do? Like, unless he got caught, like, dick deep in her sister or something like that. This seems like a massive overreaction. Oh, shit, I got me a fishing rod now. I do have a P.O. Box. You can send me whatever you want. I don't know if Coney Chili will hold, though, in the mail. That'd be a little sketchy. God damn. With everything that cult's been doing around here. I can't believe he thinks the best way to stay alive is to join those fucking psychopaths. Oh, he's joining he the cult? Get it. I'm trying to get us out of here. You see, there's this monster of a fish called the Admiral. Big cash reward for catching it. If I can nab that fish, it's our ticket out of this hellhole. Dylan can be such an idiot. Ugh, I need to clear my head for a bit. Only way I know how is fishing. Why don't you come with me? Could use the company and I'll teach you some angling tricks if you want. She's gonna teach me some angling tricks. You're gonna teach me some new angles. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. Next thing you know, this dude be shooting up your house. Don't do it. I'd be like, you can go fish alone. Be alone forever. They're all gone now. Either joined up willingly with Eden's Gate or were shipped off to the lumber mill. I hear stories about that place. All of them I don't play. Mm -mm. I don't fuck around with crazy girls. That's a bad plan. That's how you get up getting hit. Mm -hmm. after some shit around her husband. He was like a cheating shithead. So, he kind of deserved it. Anyways, see those midges over there? And that splash? Means there's fish begging to be caught. Hey, you got a rock? Give it a go. Nice cast. The fish won't want a dead bug, so keep it moving. Drop water lures that feel alive. Huh. Man, we are here fly fishing. Alright, so I got us a reel in the fish by right clicking, fight the fish by pressing the mouse in the direction of the fish's movement. Line tension builds when you fish or fight it. Reel in before it gains strength. Alright. Go. Go the the 
Uh, what are you doing, fishy? Okay, we got to be getting close, right? Dang, Fuck! It. Whatever, it's a cheap mono. Just cast again and remember tired Don't get snooty don't with me. Fun. We just met. I am new to this fly fishing thing. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I don't do any of this backwoods shit. Uh, Village Sniper, thank you very much for the sub. Appreciate that. Tier 3 sub, holy shit, man. Thank you for that, I appreciate that. Like, I shouldn't have gone fishing with this girl. I made a life mistake. See, we've known each other for 8 minutes and she's already bitching at me. She's always in there just like, me, 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 like after me over like something dumb like a broken fishing rod. I'm like, man. I'll buy you a new one. I just looted like $10,000 off a bunch of cultists. Chill. Should have left her to be alone. She deserved it. Some people don't deserve a man. And some dudes don't deserve a woman. It just, it is what it is. And some dudes don't deserve other dudes. And so on and so forth for all categories so that everyone can be involved in the conversation. Better get the fuck over here, fishy. He's taking it over to the bushes again. Oh, we almost got his ass. We almost got his ass. His little fishy balls are ours. Come, little fishy. Come. How long do I got to fight this thing for? I do not have the patience for fishing, I'll be honest with you. It takes too long. That's a big fucking fish. What the size of that goddamn thing? We catch an alligator or a fish? Jesus. Maybe it's just the ripples being weird. Is there a reason this one's not pulling out of the water? I don't feel like it's getting any closer. Oh, I gotta get- there it is. I gotta get closer to him. Gotcha. Otaku, thank you very much for the follow, man. Appreciate that. Oh, look at that cast. Flatty puts it out there. Got him! Bring this motherfucker in the boat. What's up, Village Sniper? Well, I'm glad to hear it, man. Thank you for the, uh... Thank you for the... Thank you for the sub. I, I, it's really, really awesome. Thank you for supporting me. Uh, yeah, I hear fly fishing. I'm running out of mouse pad. There you go, got another one. That's what we have here too, rainbow trout. A 14 pound rainbow trout, that's bigger than the ones we got here. Rainbow trout out here are a little ass like slip of a fish, they're tiny. That's a big ass fish. A 14 pound rainbow trout? That's a big rainbow trout. Dang, you hooked a lunker. That's a biggie, but he's no admiral. Total legend, that fish. Yeah, we got a. Uh, we got rainbow trout out here and uh, German brown are the two big things that people catch. If you drive a little bit, you can go uh, salmon fishing, but. Kind of depends how into fishing you are. Alright. 
So, uh, I'm done. You're getting pretty good at this. Keep practicing, and maybe I'll have some new pointers for you later. And thanks for listening to me ramble. Sometimes it's nice to be able to get shit off your chest, you know? Alright. Well, sorry for those who went down that road. Did she just pay me $700 to hang out with her while she fished? Shit, I'll hang out with anybody for $700 for an hour. You give me $700 an hour, I'll be your best fucking friend. There's a pretty decent opportunity. I might even include a blowjob. $700 an hour is like, you gotta do what you gotta do. $6,000 is $6,000. Is there nobody in this one? Oh, there's nobody in that one. Move it! Get my back! All right. That's what I'm saying. Is I'm trying to get that good Yelp review. Like, man, you gotta do what you gotta do. Yup, light him up, Chief. Nice one, shooter. Is that my new nickname? Like, shooter. What the fuck? Yo, who's out here with like a fucking minigun? Nope. I ain't getting run over. Shooter. Yo, but there was like some helicopter gunfire coming from over here. I don't know what that was. Somebody had like a minigun or something. What's up with this dude? Oh, he's got a bow. No wonder that hurt so much when he hit me. Who are you shouting at right now? He's standing on a pile of bodies just being like, Go fuck yourselves! Just firing bullets up into the sky. Like, goddamn. Oh, I hear a cougar. What was that? Mountain lion! Oh no! Homeboy! I got your back! Gotta take what the dead don't need. Uh, well, over the past, I haven't really assigned a whole lot of them yet. I haven't been able to get enough points. I'm saving up points right now for some other stuff. I got six points right now, and so at the moment I can unlock King of the Jungle, reduced animal attack damage, I can do uh, Survivalist, the Black Market, which means I can buy all kinds of special ammo and shit, that seems pretty rad. Uh, I got Weapons Pro, I can reload, switch SMGs and shotguns faster, I mean there's all kinds of random things in here. I kind of feel like the best way to go with this is to go with like the... Wingsuit, because who doesn't love a wingsuit? Climb up somewhere tall and just fly wherever you want to go. There's also lock picking though, which seems pretty cool. Uh, Chance the Larson, thank you very much for the follow, man. Welcome on back to the stream. I'm glad you decided to stop on in, and I'm glad you like what's going on enough to uh, support me that way. Hey, Eric Thantos. One thousand biddies. Can you tell Jack to stop clicking if it helps? He once called you lame. Wait, who's Jack? Is Jack this guy that I'm hanging out with? That's Neil. Who's Jack? There's a wolf over here. Who killed that wolf? I'm pretty sure it's like a major federal crime to kill a wolf in most of the United States. Because they're like super close to extinct. And they're like trying to repopulate all the... Uh, they're trying to repopulate the timber wolf stuff out here, but the government's doing it stupid because the government never does anything smart. And so, people don't like timber wolves very much in rural areas of the United States. You're the one that's gone poke the hornet's nest, aren't you? Deputy Pratt always came off as a bit of a douchebag. But that doesn't mean he deserves what Jacob's doing to him. Help me! 
There we go. That's what I need. I, said, I needed some bang bang gangster shit. Where? Point him out. We can kill a motherfucker today. We could be in jail by 12 o'clock. Let's go. You picked a Those fucking Peggy's chased me off, but not before I saw what they were doing. They're making judges down at the Elk Jaw Lodge. Please, you gotta do something. Yeah, like, they released a shit ton of, like, down in the White Mountains and in Arizona, New Mexico, they released a shit ton of... They're trying to... Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. That's a big bear. Why is a black bear that fucking big, dude? That's a big fucking bear. Like, black bears are usually the size of, like, big dogs out here. Like, they're not really that ter... Neil! Neil, no! Damn it, Neil. Damn it. I told you to stop fighting with bears. I told you. Don't rub yourself with that bear attracting grease before we go out on patrol. But no, you wouldn't listen. You said it makes my hands soft. It makes my neck smell good. The ladies like it. But look, Neil. Look what happened. Neil! Why are they selling Kevlar in a roadside shop? Like, apparently I stole their baseball card collection, too, because that's just the kind of hero that I am. Yeah, black bears don't get that big where I'm at. Like, they're kind of like, I wouldn't fight one, you know what I mean? But, like, they're not, like, big either. Like, you don't worry about them. Black bears tend to run the fuck off. They're not very territorial unless they got babies. And so, like, most people don't even worry about black bears. Unless it's, like, stealing their lunch money or whatever out of your little cooler. Oh, I, I want to be on the roof. I want to go where the pigeons are. I want to go where there's seagulls shitting. Oh, we're on the roof. Oh, this is so gangster. Get some. Get some. You won't. Well, thanks for that, man. I appreciate it. He just like ran over all those dudes that were trying to shoot me. I don't even think about it. Yes. Definitely parachute underneath power lines. Nothing bad will happen from this. Freeze! Get out of the car! Get out of the car! Get out of the car! Uh, Dr. Teeth, thank you very much for the sub, man. I appreciate that. Rotten Guts, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the community. And Dr. Teeth, welcome to the Nerdcastle Elite. I very much appreciate that. Well, Skylar probably got another mission for us. Looks like there's a general shop up there, and I do need ammo, so... Maybe I'll give that some thought. Mr. J! Thank you for the follow, man. Appreciate that. And then Magic Burrito, thank you for the follow as well. Polk Ziggy, 14 bitties. Appreciate that. I watched a Microsoft Edge commercial for this. I hope you're happy. Yeah, you know, I, uh... You ever wonder why companies keep beating a dead horse like that? Like, why does Microsoft Edge continue to get developed? Nobody uses it. Everybody uses Chrome or Firefox. Like shit you did, Cougar. You rolled up in the wrong neighborhood. Uh, I haven't saved the U.S. Marshal friend yet. I'm kind of just like tooling around and killing stuff. And like doing objectives as they come along. So much use. You got the look of a hunter in your eye. That's good. The way things are going... You gotta be able to fend for yourself. This fucking cult. Everyone rolled their eyes when they talked about the end of the world. But look around. Might as well be true. Rule of law is dead and gone. 
There ain't nobody protecting us anymore, so we gotta do it ourselves. Only thing that matters is staying alive and staying fed. Now, I got a few things for sale if you're interested. Ammo, gear, useful stuff in times like these. And if you got any animal do stands, you find the money for them. Saves me time from going out myself. World's a dangerous place now. If you see any of those fucking peggies, you put them down without a second <laughs> Chaos. That's true, kids. So for all the young people in my audience that might be... Your mind? Shut up. Uh, for all the people in my audience who have not done gun safety training, your finger should never be anywhere near the trigger like that if you're just standing around. Your finger should be up on the side of the gun that way, like or on the outside of the finger guard if you got a big enough finger, but it should never be inside the loop if you're not actively aiming at something that you're about to shoot. Bad trigger discipline. Chad is absolutely correct. Then again, I'm pointing a high-piled rifle sure at her right now, lasering the here. shit out of her. So, I'm not really having good trigger discipline either. See what I got here. I got a skunk skin. Okay. Boar skin worth a little bit of money. Black bear skin worth a little bit of cash. Couple of wolf skins right there. We'll sell the stack on. Ooh, wolf skins. Why are you so valuable? And then cougar skins. Ooh, we're making money today. We're making money. A damaged skin. At least you can see the damage. Five bucks. What's a trout sell for? A hundred dollars for a trout? Are you out of your goddamn mind? Dude, I can go down to the fucking lake right now and catch like 40 of those in a day if it was allowed and legal. Like, all I gotta do is throw some power bait on a hook and sneeze that shit into the water and they'll basically jump out into your cooler. Like, a hundred bucks for a rainbow trout? Hmm. Like, maybe a hundred bucks if you caught a good sturgeon. Like, maybe. Or like a good salmon, possibly, but... A fucking... a fucking trout? They're everywhere. Road killed meat. Pick out the rocks, glass, and dirt before consuming. Let's see what we can do with some weapons here. It's a smiley face shovel. Can I get like brass knuckles or anything? So what guns have I not collected yet? I assume that I got to get more resistance levels for some of the more advanced guns. Balls. Uh, what can I do with this guy right here? I could put a reflex sight on it. I didn't even know you could put a reflex sight on a Mac 11. That's wild. It needs like some kind of weird fucking mount in order to do it, but guess you got to do what you got to do. Yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> I'm sure there's that gun guy out there that's like, you can mount a fucking sight to anything if you try hard enough. You can mount a sight to anything if you got a fucking machine shop. Polk, Ziggy, and Z Putty, thank you for the biddies, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, I'm gonna no life this game pretty hard, too. Wait, I can get an extendo mag? Uh, yeah, get that. And then let's extendo mag this bitch. Yup. Oh, strapped with the heater. Oh, this is gonna be what's up. Wait, what did I just pick up? A piece of wood? I don't want a piece of wood. White tail's gotta stick together. And you ain't no white tail. Uh, the map, it updates your- it updates your area automatically, so you don't need the map. There's a reaping truck over there. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna go look, because there's a plane there. And I always need planes. So... It's the easiest for me to- it's- Oh, I can get a wingsuit. Oh, no, I could do a parachute. Ah! I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. Think about it every night and day. Spread my wings and fly away. I believe I can soar. See me running through that open door. 
I believe I can fly. I can't fly. I believe I can fly. Hey. Uh, Thantos, thank you for the biddies. I love sandwiches, dude. Sandwiches are amazing. I believe I can fly. If I just spread my wings. I don't want a fluffin' werfer. Fuck the fluffin' werfer. That thing kills me more than it kills anybody else. That thing is a liability. You might as well strap a fucking gun to the side of my head. Like, nah. Uh-uh. Is this a location with hostilities? Judging by the crucified man in the road, I'm gonna say yes. Oh, what's up, guys? Yo, I'm about to be attacked by a honey badger again. Oh, it's a wolverine. I can't hide from God, but I could definitely shoot at him. Yeah, there is. There's big time bullet drop. Fuck, man, we got problems. Shit. Watch those corners, man. You can't rush those things like that. That's dangerous business. Fucking around on corners like that. Uh, pretty much everything in the game is trying to murder you at all times. And so you should be ready to... You should be ready to GTFO and take cover at any moment. Because you never know where these dudes are going to come from. Uh, my frames are fantastic right now, Elzra. My frames are really, really good. Wolves hunting bisons over here. All kinds of weird shit going on. God damn, son. Fucking adamantium rage over here. Uh, give me a... You gotta give me something. Ow, fuck. This seems like a very stressful part of town to live in. I see you, asshole. You and your stupid little Rambo bow. See, and look at this. Now I'm down to a baseball bat. I'm down to a baseball bat from killing all you and your dudes. Like, I don't want to kill this many people. They keep forcing me to do it. I'm trying to live a life of peace. I'm trying to be out here like in the fucking, you know, Fortress of Solitude. See, and I could have just used a 50 cal on all of them, too. That's just disappointing. Uh, Heartless, thank you for the biddies, man. I appreciate that. Oh. It's Far Cry Arcade? I don't know what that is. But I'm slightly hesitant about sinking my shit to the internet right now. Another backpack over here. Um, I'll probably fish quite a bit more when I play by myself, but it seemed like chat in general was not a fan of the fishing minigame, and so I'm trying to minimize it for right now.
Dude, we're tweaking right now. Nah. God damn it, you guys. You just made a mistake. Yo, that wolf just took out that deer. That's pretty gangster. Ow. Oh, I got no med kits left. We gotta bounce. If I can't get into some cover, we got a problem. Yeah, it's getting a little bit, I agree. Um. Aw, oh, fucking flamethrower guys, man. I'm not gonna fight a guy with a flamethrower with a fucking batter, you out of your mind? We may have to evac on this one. Uh, lady, are you still up here? Gun lady, I need, oh, I need bullets. I need bullets so bad. Rambo! Uh, I'm gonna steal this plane over here. I'm gonna steal this plane. Like, we finally got ourselves out of that shitty situation. And I'm not, like, super stoked about remaining there. That road seems like kind of a... It seems like a thoroughfare where ass whoopings like to travel. And frankly, my ass is fine where it is. Any ammo around here? To the owner of the boat, I'm sorry I took the Beastmaster. I really didn't have any other choice. I've taken everything, and it's only a matter of time before they come for me. If I can make it out of here, I'll send help. Okay. I don't know what the Beastmaster is, but apparently he stole it. No, I don't really want to beat people with an oar. Another fly fishing rod over there if you ain't got one, though. I don't know. I haven't seen any bolt actions. I'm assuming there's got to be like an SKS or some kind of shit in the game though, like a sniper option. Like some kind of like fucking DVL or R like a fucking, you know. It, there's got to be some kind of, because I keep looting 50 cal bullets, so I'm assuming there's a 50 cal gun in the game. Probably a sniper rifle. Ah, uh, you are quite welcome, Jack and Ape. Thank you for the resub, man. I really appreciate that. All right, Thanks let's for get out of here. Entertainment over the years. So let's see what we got going on. Oh, really? That counts as an outpost? But, like, I already whooped the ass off that place. That's weird. Dude, I need to get the wingsuit so that I can wingsuit out of here. Yup. If I could wingsuit out of a plane, my life would be so dope. Shift to switch between parachute and wingsuit in mid-flight, allowing you to cover more distance. Oh, fuck! Wait, what saw me? Did they have like a jet fighter or something? 
Altitude. Go! Do not lower flaps above 195 miles an hour. That kind of seems like a no-brainer. Let's figure out an objective that we want to hit. What are these little squares? Oh, they're just little, okay. They're information locations. A silo over there. I'll be honest, I ain't seeing a whole lot. Otaku boy, thank you for the five biddies. I don't know. Let's go to Moonflower Trailer Park. Hey, Sharky here. We're setting up a surprise barbecue for these brain dead cultists at the trailer park. Alright. Uh, yeah, TV guy, we're keeping going. We're not going anywhere for right now. It's a pretty big map. I have the dog. I haven't gotten the cougar or the bear yet. Jack and Abe is pretty good. I like it. It's fun. I think the guns aren't quite as satisfying as 4 and 3, but I mean the game as a whole is still very good. I mean to be fair, Far Cry used to be about mutants and shit. In the first Far Cry game you had all kinds of weird mutant powers and bullshit, and then after that it became like a, like a guerrilla warfare simulator. Uh, Wildcat, the developers, gave me a copy so that I could show it off early. I have a very, very solid working relationship with Ubisoft over the years. They're actually them and Squaresoft. I have them and Square Enix. I have really, really good relationships with both of those companies. Man. That's a big-ass game. We still got another kilometer to go. Um, I wasn't super impressed with Final Fantasy 15, and so I don't know how I feel about the Final Fantasy 7 remake. Nah, it's a statue of the weird cult guy that's taking over Montana. Hey, what's up, Wicked? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Uh, Talcatious, good to see you as well. Welcome on in. Yeah, sorry. Good old square soft. Well, this is my stop. Oh shit. Wing suiting. Wing shooting. That's kind of a long ways down. Yeah, you pulled that shoot way too close to the ground, man. Like, holy shit, that was close. You can't pull a parachute that close to the ground, guys and gals. It does not work like that. You will smash into the ground at like a thousand miles an hour and you will die and it will be horrible. Alright, so what's he up to? That's well adjusted. I am Charlemagne Victor Beauchamp. Now, if you require more brevity in your day-to-day -day life, you can just call me Sharky. Welcome to the Disco Inferno, man. It's my special place where I can just be me, without the prying eyes of my PO or witnesses <laughs> or law enforcement types <laughs> such as yourself. Here is where I am free to unleash my fire and mayhem in a pants-free. 
consequence for your environment. I have pants on now, yes, but who knows what the next half hour, 45 minutes hold. Got a sweet ass sound system rigged for 110 decibels of the hottest music ever created. Every time I crank it up, man, those dipshit cult angels, they just come running, and I can't tell if they love it or hate it, but I'm telling you, it sure is fun to melt their faces off. And don't worry, man, the angels, they's already brain dead. I'm just giving them a glorious send-off to disco heaven, man. You wanna help? It's good fun, man. I promise not to tell anyone. We don't even have to wear pants or nothing. I supply the music, and I use the flamethrower to make them dance, and you use your, um, I don't know, whatever it is you got. Let's just burn this mother down. This is... I like how he's got loads of guitar pedals. No. Uh, cause they're high on bliss, apparently. They're high on like a drug that the, the cult grows out here. Man, you do you. Oh, but there's so many speakers, man. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna need you to calm up. Thank you very much for the Amazon Prime sub right there. I appreciate that, man. Oh, there's another fucking one? Get out of here. I will shoot you in the neck. Oh, you will shoot me in the neck, too. You better get the fuck up there, man. Don't do that! Don't do that! No! Oh, you fucking idiot. They got big guns. Fuck.
Ah, oh, fuck you. Fuck's sake. Oh no. Wait, you're still alive? Well, stop that. Stop being alive. Uh, Drunk Firok, thank you very much for the follow. That's right, fuck your shit kicker. I don't know why I hang out with you, man. It's one of those dudes you hang out with and it's always a liability. Like, ain't nothing good ever gonna, ha like, come from hanging out with this dude. Like, it'll be funny. It'll be entertaining. It'll be perfectly fine. But, that being said, open saves with a remote explosives, acquire lockpicking, and repair torch to- Oh. What's up? Well, there's all the fucking stuff I was looking for. Wow, that was a hell of an explosive right there. Hey, a map. Nice. Alright, so the next question is like... Wait, I can get a car? Oh my god. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me refill my ammos real fast. And let's go shopping. And see what's going on. So we've got a customizable set of vehicles we can get here. Yo! That's the one that I need right there. Man, these cars are whack. I don't want these. Dumbass Crown Vic looking shit. I don't care about that. Show me the wheels, son. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Fucking Challenger. Fucking Charger with a goddamn 50 cal on top. Fuck yeah. That's how we Road Warrior. What else we have? You can have, like, a battle tractor. I don't have the money for any of this stuff, but, like, I can look at it and I can lust after it. Apparently, Wolverine skins are worth a whole bunch, so there you go. Wait, I can have a knife? Can I loot that knife right there? No? Oh, I wanted to have the combat knife. I will, however, pick up all this ammo while I'm over here. Might as well loot these dudes. I kind of miss, like, in the previous games, I liked how you looted things off of people, like wallets and watches and stuff like that, and then you sold those at vendors. I just liked the, like, huge quantity of random shit you could loot off of random people. Gold chains and bracelets and, like, picture frames and stuff like that. I don't know, I miss it. Oh my god, Jack and Ape, it's your birthday? Happy birthday, bro. Oh. Fuck that bison. You don't know me like that. What's up? Yup. That's how we do right there. Let me get that bison skin. Oh, you're dead. Ah! Hey, fuck you guys. Can you just roll on me like that? Get dealt with, bison.
I'll hip fire your shit to death. I don't even care. Please believe. That's it. We're doing this shit, gangster. Pull the Mac Billy and let's go. Yup, return up the Mac once again. Return up the Mac top of the world. Return up the Mac. I'll be busting on your ass. Gotta shoot a bison now. Gotta lay the cow on down. Got the biggest gun in town. Man, that's a resilient animal right there. That thing is bulletproof. Oh, there's a bear over there too. So I'm full on bison skins. There's really no point in me murdering more bisons. Uh oh. Yeah, I'm not trying to burn in right now. Why is everything always trying to murder me? Ah! Got no ammo! Fuck! Run! Me and my five bullets are gonna retire. I do already have a wingsuit. I love my wingsuit. It's pretty sexy. What's up with this guy? Dude, why are you running up on me like a creeper like that? The fuck? Alright, Speedy Gonzalez, I'll see you later. <laughs> what the fuck? Ow. Don't ask me how I did it, but I got my ATV lodged in a tree. His specifics aren't important right now. It happened. What's done is done. <laughs> that guy's ready to fight, man. He's ready to go in. <laughs> How much does a bison skin affect? Ooh, 200 a pop. All right, totally worth it. 450 bucks worth of ammo for... This map reveals the locations for Clutch's, Clutch Nixon's legendary stunts. Okay. Hey, the Swat Cat. Thank you very much for that subscription right there. Very much appreciate it. Welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite. It's fantastic to have you. Uh, welcome on down. I could kill some more bison so we could make some more money. That one's rolling though. Look at him. He's like a big cute dog. I don't want to fucking kill him. I feel bad. I feel like an asshole. This is Virgil Minkler speaking. Anyone looking for refuge, come to the Hope County Jail. We have beds and food here. Beds and food here. Okay. Uh, your maximum health is increased. I could definitely use that. We are squishier than fuck right now. So that'd be great. Uh, repair torch is added to your utility wheel. You can open v- Oh, cool. Nice. I'll get that too. Sweet. Alright. Let's be on our way. There it is, that handbrake action. That's what we're trying to, we gotta catch me in the twisties, son. Catch me in the twisties! <laughs> Ow.
Will you stop? Just fucking stop, man. What are you doing? If you won't swerve to hit wildlife, what will you swerve for in this game? Drive by! Drive by! Sess West side, homie! Mm-hmm, that's what you get for fucking around in the suit! Well, see, like, you guys tried to shoot up my car. It's the twisties, man. That's when you go out. You go out and you race in the twisty roads where motherfuckers spin out. Like fly off cliffs and shit. See me in the twisties. Well, this looks a tad overly hectic. Got an extra like fitty cow I could jump onto. Really saved our bacon. They've been throwing themselves at these walls for days. This won't let up. Here, kicked open a hornet's nest. Trucks on the road! Damn it! No! Random unnamed NPC with red shirt 47! No! Whoa, 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 RPG, fuck! You know what I have to do. I have to go get that RPG. Which wall? West side wall, fuck. Get the fuck out of the way, NPC! I'm the hero! I didn't mean to throw a grenade. I hit the wrong key. Wait, what? Oh, yes. God damn it. Man, I'm gonna need you to bring your A game up real fast. Fucking rocket was too slow. Hey, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you, Comet. Fuck your talk radio. Get the fuck out of here, NPR. I kind of feel like I'm being shot from a lot of directions right now. 
Oh, sorry, man. That was my bad. Here. The least I can do is help you back up. I got scared. Yo, though, there's one behind you. Oh, my bad. Sorry, Sheriff. I didn't mean anything by it. It just happened. It all happened so fast. Ah! Ow! Asshole! God. Rogers, there's an Arkweller somewhere inside. Buddy was using it last. Get on it. Well, you're with me. Let's start collecting scrap. You have to pull the doors off some of the cells? Do it! Now hop to! We ain't got much time! No problems? No. A couple of the Peggy scaled the wall, but we got him. Door. That doesn't look too bad. You'll be all right. Just keep pressure on it. You know, I was gonna retire last year. I was worried I'd get You bored. shoulda. You fucking shoulda. Should've retired and gone the fuck somewhere else. From what I've seen in this game, Montana sucks. What's up with all these wood cultists? Vulgar mine is a sign of... You're not wearing your button! No, I'm not wearing it. I'll need a casualty report. We're, we're cougars. I have no we're idea really why not. they're called Peggy's. Look, I'm wearing my button. The sheriff is wearing his button. This person... Oh, well, there I'm you sorry, go. Beaver knows, because Beaver's smarter than me. This is one of my deputies. I thought you said your deputies were taken. Well, this one wasn't. Been giving Eden's Gate a hell of a time from what I hear. <laughs> That's so. Well, I hope you plan on pitching in. No room for freeloaders. Oh, Tracy's all right when she gets to know you. She's right about the world. She's just though. mad because she's got that Might extra unnecessary E in her name. Just ask around. Couldn't have you back, bro. The only thing special around me is an extra letter. Ah! Okay, then. He gave me a button. I can put it on my punk rock jacket. Is it on me now? Yo, why am I tweaking out, though? Ooh, free grenades. Who else has loot? No, I'm looting your... Ooh, they got pizza? What? Man, I've been biting raw chunks off of bisons and shit, and they're over here living good. God, I got that good life. The roadkill test confirmed my worst fear. I don't think a mine can be recovered once it's overexposed to the agent. Note to self, write up detailed findings later. I need to do more research to be sure. Maybe if I can't cure the angels, I can do something else to help them or us. I'll need more samples of the agent. The biological material is affected and I have to try. As overwhelming as the day-to-day -day cases are, this is something I could do. I know it. Wolverines! Ride! Hello, dear. I feel like you've got ahead of yourself. He was the head of his game. The head of his class. Oh, well, I can handle that. Hold on. What's up? Wait, why are all my utilities empty? Why can't I blow this door open with an explosive? How are you making out? How am I making out? I don't know. People say I do satisfactory. I don't know. Gonna be honest. You gotta balance the amount of fucking tongue, though. That's the secret. Now, you can't go in too hard and be like, ah, 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 but you can't, like, not do it either. You know what I mean? Then I saw her. You've seen her, too, haven't you? Whatever she says, whatever she promises, it's a lie. Stay away from her, you'll end up just like the marshal. The bliss. It makes you forget. It makes you feel free. You just want to stay there forever. But it isn't real. None of it. If Virgil and Tracy hadn't found me, I'd still be out there, swimming in a sea of bliss. A prisoner in my own head. Those two saved my life. Hey, what's up, Hug? Yeah, I'm liking it. There's some really intense gunfights. But they're hanging on by a thread. We gotta help them, Rook. No one else will. Bliss is the drug that the cultists are growing thing. out of some weed thing that we they have out in the fucking forest. Well, Makes people like PCP strong. 
guy went missing a Makes people all ago. meth hard. Don't know why, don't know how. Keep an eye out for him, would you? I don't know what happened to Snoop Dogg. I gotta go find him. Last two days, we've had a few people go missing. Only from what we can tell, they weren't lost in the Hey, place. what's up, Horace? Welcome back. Good to see There's you again. rumors of some place run Don't do it. Favorites. The, water treatment and the kind of place memory. nobody comes back from. Torture, drownings, sacrifices. People say anyone who doesn't walk Faith's little pilgrimage winds up there. I think we got a real problem on our hands, and I need someone to check it out. Someone who can handle themselves if it turns out to be more than just stories. Be careful, Rook. Here's the real question. When do I get some bomb-ass aviators? Good day, sir. Can I just, like, have that? Faith has that Marshall All right. trapped in the bliss. Apparently that wasn't shoplifting. Faith is a master manipulator. She can make anyone turn on their best friend. Me too, Marble Dan. That's my favorite mode in like Gears of War and whatnot, is the one where you have a team and you've just got to hold out for as long as possible against endless hordes. I love that shit. That gameplay mode does something for me, and I don't know. Like I love that gameplay mode. I only have fifteen hundred dollars. The question is, do I want to spend fifteen hundred dollars? Do I want to spend $1,500 to ball out? Yeah, I think it has to happen. There we go. That's what I'm... Wait, what are those right there? Hold up. Yup. That's what I'm talking about right there. Them old 90s glasses? Yup. You made White Horse proud. No way, man. We gotta have the Tennessee top hat. Heard you were involved in that big fight at the jail. Yeah. You were here. Uh, you should know. I was involved with a fight at the jail. This is a tiny ass prison, dude. This is a really little prison. This thing is super small compared to like CMF and all the prisons we got out here. Like Martinez and shit. This place is tiny. Oh, the Boars. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome, welcome, welcome on in. That is a pretty sick mullet. I'll be honest with you. I personally would rock that mullet in real life. The secret is getting it up to that level where it's that epic. I would rock that mullet all day long. People would make fun of me. I wouldn't give a shit. I'd be like, I'll rock the, I'll rock the fuck out of this ape drape. Please believe. Uh, Wolf the Pass. So far, all we've seen is trout. Lots and lots and lots of trout. Doc Lindsay confirms, no reversal for angels. No clear process now. Pilgrimage sometime, but not always. Sometimes resistance, sometimes civilians. Ritual tradition breakdown under stress conditions. New priorities. No rumors. Mean unpredictable point of no return. Same message. Freeing people must be top priority. I've got an ape drape. Yes, I do. I've got an ape drape. How about you? Thank you. I mean, to be fair, a prison wouldn't be a terrible place to fucking hold up if you were under siege. Hey, what's up, Damp Llama? How you doing? Yeah, there is. There's a compound bow you can get. I would like some body armor. Thank you. Did they give me my, uh... They keep my blowtorch back. Where's my blowtorch at? You won't believe what they're doing with that bliss now. Dumping it right into the drinking water. They said I had a blowtorch, but I don't know where it's at. Gotta stay sharp. Another attack could come at any moment. Heck, you might even be impressed with your old man. Man, fuck it. All things are messy right now, but you'd be proud Ooh, silver bars. They're hidden at every outpost and other places. Oh, so apparently you can find silver bars or you can just buy them. I don't know. Forty silver bars. Goody. 
doop 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 the first box the big box on the right of the tools menu oh that's the blowtorch I thought that was like a dynamite or something dude can I blowtorch somebody's face off hold up hold still My bad! I didn't mean it! Ah! No! It wasn't my fault. It was a fucking accident. I had to find out if it could be weaponized. Like, how would I know if it was weaponized unless I tried it once? I don't even know what they're shooting. They're shooting at me, is what they're shooting at right now. Uh, DeBeansta, thank you very much for the follow, man. Welcome to the Nerd Castle. It's fantastic to have you as part of the community. If anybody else wanted to join up and have a good time with me multiple times a week, I stream five days a week. That seems like a bad idea. Maybe I should not do that. Uh-oh. Jay Pickle, thank you for the follow as well. And Geek Rom, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the community. That girl got stank breath. She got that morning breath. She needs to acquaint herself with a toothbrush. Extra aggressive. I know you've heard stories about me. Uh-oh. That I'm a liar. A manipulator. <laughs> I poison people's lives. Uh, pay him. Thank you very much for the resub, man. Welcome to the Blue Man Crew. Burn the world with fire. You're blue. Da ba dee da ba da da ba dee da ba da da ba dee da ba da True story. I don't trust you, Liv Tyler. Get out of here. There once was a young woman who had been ostracized by her community. Nobody should use ostriches as weapons like that. Bullied by friends. Abused by her family. She took to a needle for help. She was all alone. She wanted to die. But then she started a cult that's all okay now. Just shows. The cure to clinical depression and PTSD? Starting a cult. <laughs> Who knew? He gave her hope and confidence. The father showed her how special she was. She was full of love and life. Oh, you special, all right. Family, one that accepted her just you like as fucking she was. helmet in the shopping cart special. The woman no longer wished to die. She had been given purpose. Yo, she's definitely a mutant. She's a heretic. Burn her. In the righteous fires of the Emperor. Burn her now. Exterminatus. Heresy. None shall improve upon what yes. the Emperor declares angels. Eat bolt of fire, wench! It's good, Regdor, I like it a lot. Send for the Commissars! Send her to the black ships for testing. Walk the path. Oh, Snoop Dogg's in the cult now.
You know, he doesn't even look like Snoop Dogg. It was just in that one scene, there was a particular angle that made him look like Snoop Dogg. And that's just, he's now Snoop Dogg forever. What the fuck? Man, you got some big ass nostrils, fool. What, you been snorting golf balls? Damn. Yo, this is on some deep religious shit right now. Nah, I think I'm good, Joseph Smith. I think I'm solid. I'm gonna stay right here on the book until a helicopter come get me. Nope. Ain't gonna do it. Let your faith be your guide. Leap. Accept the word of the Father into your heart. <laughs> it is I, Jesus. <laughs> Hello, I am Jesus. <laughs> I want to know if I get like a... Let your faith be your guide. Leap. Accept the word of the Father into your heart. Like, I want to know if I don't go into this, if I get like a secret ending or something, if I'm just like, No! I resist! I will not be tamed. Hello, I... M. Jesus. <laughs> Let your faith be your guide. Leap. Accept the word of the Father into your heart. Prophecy. Chapter 7. Is the book closing? I can't decide if I'm high as fuck or if the book is actually closing. Uh, the book total. It feels like it's closing, man. Let your faith be your guide. Leap. Accept the word of the Father into your heart. I can't tell. This seems like one of those weird things where the audience can't decide. I think it's just his head moving around that's making it seem. Now! Leap. Accept the word of the Father into your heart. I don't think there's anything here, man. Yeah, I'm, I agree with Jacob. I think it's a trick of perception because he keeps moving his head around and it keeps zooming in and slightly out. I think it's just playing on your eyes. Let your faith be your guide. Leap. Accept the word of the Father into your heart. If you're supposed to wait here, it's been taking a long ass time. I think his head just keeps leaning and that's what's doing it. Eh. I will give you purpose. I will set you free. Yo, you said I was gonna fly, you fucking liar. Apparently, I didn't get enough pixie dust. My happy thought wasn't good enough. My happy thought was fucking terrible. It took 15 minutes in Far Cry 4? I'm not sitting here for 15 minutes. They can wait on that. There's a lot of dead people down here. I can fix them. I have the tools. He was the sixth million dollar man. Feel different? Do you feel alive? The first step is always the scariest. But we all have faith in you. Follow the pilgrimage. Walk the path. I'll see you soon. I don't see Snoop around here. A lot of Bibles though. 
Or I guess cultist Bibles. Hmm. I mean, I was going to blow up that crate until it made me tweak out hella hard. <laughs> we can rebuild him. It worked! Man, fuck those Peggies. They don't know me like that. Uh, why are you over here? Destroy the statue of Father. I'll catch that dude right in his nuts. I don't care. Oh, where'd she go? Oh, that's a trip. I don't think it's working anymore, and I ran out of bullets. I ran out of missiles. I don't know. That's a good point. What happens if you blow up the statue before that cutscene? I gotta fucking get revenge because that lady tried to roofle in me. And that's a no-no. I gotta figure out a way to get back up there. I don't have the grappling hook, so I can't, like, do the grapple thing to get up there. I think you need the grappling hook. How many points do I have right now? Oh, it only costs one? Well, shit, why didn't I buy that in the first place? That's true, I did buy a wingsuit instead. Hopefully I've got enough C4 to make this happen. This is a very sketchy free climb. This stinks of mistake. I don't like free climbing, man. Free climbing is dangerous. Like, I'll do it if I have to, but in general, I don't like free climbing. Uh, Krell is missed. Thank you for the 10 biddies. Appreciate that. Welcome to the stream. How's your day going? But yeah, as I was saying before we trip balls, if you wanted to follow like so many people before have today, uh, hit that follow button. It's right up there above the stream. And honestly, it'll give you uh, notifications every single time I go live so that we can hang out more frequently. Lady, you don't know me. Ooh, a cult VIP. Ooh. Yeah, I need to get something a little different here. Oh, fuck! There's a sniper. Fucking sniper. Did he just fire a fucking mortar? Oh, Jesus. Oh, I see you. You think you're sneaky. Oof. The fuck? Oh, hey, what's up? Ow. Dude, what the fuck? Don't you feel like that's a little bit of overkill? Try to stick your head up over the edge. You won't.
Oh, I don't want that. I want the RPG, though. I definitely want the RPG. Where'd the RPG run off to? Where'd the RPG go? There's definitely an RPG over here. I thought he was tucked into this little... Oh, there it is. Kind of. Maybe. Uh, ooh. Ooh, he's got one with a little scope of dope on it. He fired from like an angle over here. But I need explosives. Otherwise, this is not going to work. Hi. I think I upset him. Goodbye to that waste of concrete. Hey, if you're looking to cause more trouble, I got an idea. Faith keeps her personal copy. Uh, Elk, I'll see you later. Thanks for coming to the stream, man. Climb inside that statue and burn those papers. Show her what happens when you fuck with the wrong people. Oh, fuck. That's not good. Yeah, it's got a different barrel on it, I think. Man, you can eat dicks. Run up on me. I pray you do. Alright, we gotta John Wick these guys. Pro Dizzle, welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite. Thank you for your support, man. I really appreciate it. I'm a little bit encumbered right now by people shooting at me, but I do want to say thank you for that. Very, very kind of you. So yeah, this thing's full of bliss. Wait, what is that right there? What does that do? Oh, nothing. Oh, I'm gonna get shot doing this. Why do you reload? Why does he reload so slowly? God. I'm going to get the one that can go full auto and has a bigger magazine because that gun right there, I got to reload it too frequently. Shit. Oh, there's a sniper right there. I see his ass. What's up, Chief? So I got to get up there. Like a climbing spot around here or something. Oh, it's an elevator. Watch the skies. You got some choppers flying your way. Choppers? Oh, fuck, dude. Fucking mean choppers.
How do these guys have so much military ordnance, man? Fuck! Apparently they got bulletproof glass. A peak key would make my life easier. I don't know if small arms fire is going to be enough to get this thing done. I don't know who the dickhead is is throwing fucking grenades at me. I don't see any RPGs around, unfortunately. There's one. Got him! a month I go out to pick up the newspaper and get assaulted by a white ethno-nationalist cult. <laughs> I like that big pause right there. It really it really told me that you were trying to sell a different idea. Uh, Rock Guy, thank you very much for the resub. Welcome on back. Good to see you again. Where's the chopper at? I'm trying to ace that chopper before anything else goes wrong. I'll be honest with you. Oh, it was a safe. Hold on. Splatty gotta get that loot. Why are all these crates from like 1843? Um. Oh, it's gonna attack me when. Okay. It's gonna attack me when I hit that. I guarantee it. Oh, good sweet lord. Is that a fucking saw? Oh, shit. Dude, there ain't no way that fucking thing stays in the air. That's what I'm talking about. Yo, can I take this home and have it be my friend forever? Do I ever have to get another gun other than this one? Because this gun's pretty dope. And it's pretty much all that I want in the entire world. you want to bet they got another one coming from my stupid ass there's a lot of rockets up here but is there an RPG to go with said rockets or should I have just brought one with me button. Let's saw this safe open.
I do feel much safer from helicopters now, though. I definitely don't fear for my safety. Dude, if I get the wingsuit off of this thing at the end after I blow this shit up, it's gonna be amazing. It's kind of weird how you blow the plating off of this thing and then there's a level inside of it. It's pretty creative, I like that. burned your holy book son i burned your holy book get some what's up ancient how's it going man welcome here uh, it's good to see you i don't suppose his words don't you understand what he'll do to me what have you done how about don't roofie me and i won't blow up your big ass stupid dad statue how about that how about that, son? That was fucking beautiful. Joseph C is gonna be shitting bricks, and Faith is gonna feel the heat now. She'll need to answer for that burned book and that mangled effigy. Hell of a job. Like, you could have kept your big, stupid, gaudy statue, but no, you had to start beef. Rook, you're doing a hell of a job out there. Faith doesn't like disobedience. We got word there's an armed patrol cruising the river, and it sounds like she's called in the Chosen. Yeah, I worried right. about it. Gonna make you hallucinate, and if you breathe it for too long, <sighs> well, you could wind up like the marshal. White horse out. I did what I came to do. Shit. No! No! You will not get rid of my beautiful, wondrous Thunder Gun. No. Thunder Gun is my friend and it will stay with me. I love you, Thunder Gun. Whee! Bye bye. Uh, Boss Briar, thank you for the follow, man, and welcome to the Nerd Castle. It's great to have you. Welcome on in. Oh, uh, look at that. Now it just looks like a comm tower. Man, I fucked up all your ideas about what you were supposed to be doing with your religion, huh? I think I gotta pitch it in order to make it work. I think. Well, damn, that was a fucking adventure. That, uh, that turned into a big old doing, didn't it? So we got Dr. Charles Lindsay. What other stuff we got going on over here? I mean, obviously I need more ammo for Thunder Gun, but... Let's go help this kitty over here. It's Splattercat's kitty rescue. Pop, 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 We heard there was a kitty in need. Descend! Descend! Nah, there's no doc on this one. I think this was just like a news helicopter or some shit. I want to see how much higher up I can go. Is there like an altimeter on this thing? That looks like it's about as high as I can go. Wingsuit didn't really get me the way I wanted to. Uh, JT, probably for a little while longer. Let's maybe find... So there was a big building up here. And Splatty's got a big gun, so... I'm not trying to worry about whatever's going on over here. I will roll up in this place and fuck everybody up. I'll come through here like a fucking thunderstorm. 
really happened. Noodle passed away last night. In no! Sleep. I can't imagine my house without seeing that big dumb baby lazing around the place. If you could, I'd like to keep Noodle around. I can send you his favorite climbing post. You can close him on. Oh, they're inverted? I had no idea. <laughs> and maybe you can put a mouse in his mouth. It was his favorite snack. I don't know if you ever stuffed a snake before. Oh, I'm sorry. Come by my place and get him when you can. I wonder what Noodle was. Like, what kind of creature was Noodle? Because we're kind of in a backwoods area where I feel like people are going to have weird pets. Oh, look. More family valuables for me to burgle. Oh, it was a snake. I wasn't really paying attention. Uh, Fro Dizzle, thank you for the follow. I don't like snake people, man. Snakes get what they deserve. I don't understand people that have snakes for pets. I just, we have nothing in common. I'm like, hmm, nah. I'm not afraid of snakes or anything. I just, I just, I just don't understand other people's attraction to them. I'm like, it's a fucking. It's... What's up, lady? Um, hello. An older white woman has requested assistance. Okay. You're just gonna ignore me. What has this country come to? <laughs> like, as opposed to like an older, black or brown woman, like. I don't really know what we're doing here. Those miserable shits raided my place trying to kill my peaches. Now she's raced off for her revenge. If I know peaches, she's gone off to chow down on those hippies. She's probably lounging at the nearby campsite. It smells like armpits and processed meat down there. So those Eden Project losers can't be far away. Go on and find her now. Be sure to take her treats with you. She's just like that little drubbing whore at the marina. She'll follow you anywhere if you give her a treat. I understand now. Now go get my kitty back. We must all walk the path. Okay. I just wanted to go get peaches, and I guess this is have these eggs been on the stove for long? There's still a few big cats out there in the woods. Um, let's go rescue Peaches. Apparently I have Peaches' special treats. Uh, Lickety Split, thank you for uh, following. I appreciate that. Sirocco, thank you for following as well. Really appreciate that from all of you. Welcome. Hope you guys enjoy the streams over the coming weeks. I really, really do. Uh, let's maybe, like... Okay, maybe not. Maybe that was a mistake. Maybe I should think about things a little bit better in my life. Peaches! Hey, Wolfie, I gave you your freedom. I gave you your freedom. Don't betray me. He was like, God, I was just coming over for some pets. My bad. My bad, bro. Lock and load this big beast. I don't think we're ever going to use a different gun. I, um, I love this gun. This gun is pretty much my best friend that I've ever had. I like this gun a lot. Oh, that one's dead. Uh, JT the goalie. Thank you very much for the subscription, man. Welcome to the Nerd Castle. Elite! Wolfie is no match for LMG. Ooh! Ancient Tatro. Thank you very much for that $10 as well. Uh, so I can work on my titties. Man, LMG makes quick work of everything in this game. Normally, Wolf's got a little bit of, like, body armor to him. Yeah, tip my hat to you. Thank you very much for the support. Peaches? Peaches? Here, kitty, kitty, kitty.
Uh, Ancient Tatro, thank you for the follow as well, man. Welcome to the stream. It's good that you made it. Glad that you could stop on in. Uh... Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. I'm doing pretty well, Dagon. I'm doing pretty well. I'm enjoying the game a lot. I could see myself playing the shit out of this in my free time, but we're going to keep it on stream for a while. I'll probably play this a bunch this week. God, this thing's a problem solver. Well, thank you. I appreciate that, JT. It's very, very kind of you, man. I try to, like, I don't know. Like, I never want to do, like, the internet guy thing where, like, my personality online is different than my personality in real life and it's, like, all an act or whatever. Like, I just wanted to hang out with people on the internet and, like, talk while I play games and just have a good time and make some jokes and shit like that. Like, I wanted it to be, like, my, my viewers and my audience were, like, sitting on the couch with me and we were just dicking around playing video games, talking about whatever. That's always, like, what I envisioned for what the stream content would feel like. And so I'm glad we get to do that every single day, man. This is, like, a dream come true for me. Uh, Steel Autumn, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. It's good to have you. Oh, you got that last minute spring bag schoolwork, huh? Peaches? I don't think Peaches is in here. Sorry, Wolfie. I need your skin so that I can have delicious money so that I can buy more heavy ordnance. It's not my fault. I don't want to kill you, I just kind of, it's convenient. It, it checks a lot of boxes for me. Uh, Fabsy, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in, man. I appreciate it. I uh, hope you're having a good day. Um, I'd say it's better than four, but probably not as quite as good as three. I don't know, I haven't gotten far enough in yet. How did the- How in the fuck did they get a helicopter in here? Like, how would you even fucking get this in here? What the shit? No way. Shenanigans. There's no way they got that in here. Jesus. We got Maverick over here flying this thing. Good lord. Ooh, perk magazines. And lots and lots of money. Fuck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get paid. If it thinks I'm gonna try and fly that helicopter out of here, this game is out of its damn mind. There's no way. No, you guys just want to see me die horribly. I know my chat. My chat is always trying to convince me to do dumb shit so that I die. That's like 90% of what you guys do. You'd be like, Splat, I got an idea. You should do this clearly terrifying thing that's definitely gonna end in your death and it's totally a good idea. You guys are trying to get me killed, as usual. What is that jingle bell noise? That's fine, you can smell chicken all day long because it's so hot in here, I'm cooking. So they took that helicopter in here, up over that lip and down a hole, man. You would have to be the most fucking badass helicopter pilot in the history of the world. So like, if I wanted to help, I want to... I wanted to help Peaches. Hello? This is Ms. Mabel. Where's Peaches at? I wanted myself a battle kitty. What the fuck? Oh shit, that badger just turned into a bear! Ah! Yo, are you allowed to hunt grizzly bear with an LMG? Or like, can you hunt herds of sheep with an LMG? Like, I, I realize that's a terrible thought to have, but yo... A 
Like, I really feel like we should open up, like, competitive hunting where you're allowed to, like, hunt a moose with a rocket launcher. Like, we should legalize it, like, one day a year. That's it. It'll be, like, the purge, but for animals. Like, one day a year, you pay, like, ten times as much for a hunting license to use any fucking gun you want. Any gun you want. I mean, Hugbringer, you can call it what you want to call it, but either way, it'd be pretty fucking crazy. Hello? Hello? This is Shut up, Mabel. I'm busy LMGing. Oh shit, almost got her with that one. Ain't no point trying to fight. Just get drunk and die, I say. Long time admirer of your work here. Don't know if I know if you know mine. I'm happy to introduce you. How's your health care? Because if you have anything for your heart or joints or whatever, I can hook you up. I went to college for several semesters, so you know it's safe. For you, I only got one asking price. If I kick it before you do, I want to be immortalized. Stuff me. We can talk about the pose and the final resting place and all that later. Think how cool that might be. Let me know if you're interested. I got some good stuff for rheumatism, epilepsy, cancer, anxiety, just in case. Uh, Mr. Kirby. There we go. Got him. Let's go get a kitty. I can't retire for the evening until I've gotten a kitty. We have to complete this task. Yeah, I figured that was going to hurt. Uh, stuff or su Sufi in the saddle. Thank you for the follow, man. I appreciate that. Welcome to the Nerd Castle. Good to have you. Got to cross this chasm over here. We got a new enemy in Eden's Gate, the Cougar. These vile beasts have attacked some beloved servants of the Father. If you see any Cougars, kill them. It's a rough dating game out here. I don't know why I'm bothering to be. I don't know why I'm bothering with stealth when I have an LMG as my main weapon. Like it just seems, uh, McChugger Nugget. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the Nerd Castle. Good to have you. Eliminate his enemies. The enemies of Peaches will suffer. Uh, 135 biddies right there from Funicus. Thank you very much. I don't know what's over there, so I'm just gonna kind of spray bullets at it. That's what LMGs are for, right? Like, I mean. LMGs are not really for precision fire, you just kind of like suppress, and if you hit something, you fucking hit something, you know? I don't know if there's a prone mode, I don't think there is. Uh, Wolf of, or Wolf to the Past, thank you very much for the biddies right there. Wait, I'm leaving the mission zone? Well, put me back in the mission zone. Fantastic! Thank you very much for using your Amazon Prime sub on me. Appreciate that. Welcome to the Nerdcastle Elite. Check out the uh, the secret room that I've got for all the Nerdcastle Elites to hang out in and have all kinds of unmoderated fun. And then, of course, uh, check out the emotes and enjoy your ad-free viewing. Thank you. Peaches. Peaches. Oh, I gotta throw Peaches' treats. Okay. Uh, Peaches' is treats. Are those them? Yep. Get 
Buddy! Come on, kitty. Let's get out of here. Kitty, kitty, kitty. We got a new kitty. You guys have no idea how happy I would be if I personally had a pet puma. That should be like life changing for me. Like if anybody in the audience right now has the ability to give me a pet puma and you want to change my life for the better forever. Um, Hello, this is Miss Mabel. Hook your boy up with a new puma. See, that's how you get rid of a sniper right there. How tame does the pet puma have to be? Pretty fucking tame, man. Like, I'll train it or whatever, but like, it's gotta be pretty tame. Come on, peaches. Thank you very much for that sub as well. Appreciate that. Welcome to the Nerd Castle Elite. You guys are just. Lose the property. I want that murdering cougar dead. That oh man. I don't have any. Peaches, are you here? Does Peaches count as a homie? Can I command her? No. When it gets gangster, boo doo doo, boo, boo boo boo. When it gets gangster, yeah. Let me tell you a little something about the homies I roll with. We chin check bitches. We don't go for that whole shit. Come to the bloody nickel, looking to stomp fifty thousand. Say I knock your ass out with one punch. Uh. And I don't care how many rap songs you listen to, or the fact that you smoke weed and pack a gun, I see the punk in you. Uh, I mean, I'd be okay with it. She was kind of mean to me. Like, she was a little short, you know what I mean? Lure peaches into her pen. Okay. Peaches. Stop consuming human flesh and come hang out inside this cage over here. How much barbed wire do you need on one cage? Holy shit, dude. This does not seem like a safe pet. This seems like a very, very... Bad plan. Where's my payment? You're sharper than you look. Damn right. Where's my payment? Where's my money? I'll be honest. I figured I'd never see you again. Thought you were a little dim in the headlights, but you proved me wrong. Ah oh, hell. Why don't you just keep the damn cat? I've enjoyed not having to deal with her incessant needs for food and water and attention the last few days. All right, off you go. We're done here. Uh, Ruggio, I'll see you later. Thanks for coming. Yay, we've got a kitty! We've got a kitty. We've got a kitty. We've got a kitty. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, uh, we got to assign the kitty. Let's go. Yup. There it is. Come on, kitty. Come along, battle cat. Ride with me. You must be dizzy. So many roads to choose. What to believe, who to help first. When to trust. When you find the path, you'll see clearly. Yo, that's a big ass animal. And I'll show you Did you know that pumas are like the third largest cat on the planet? A lot of people don't know that. 
after like lions and Bengal tigers, there's the fucking North American puma. They are fucking huge if you've never seen one. They are really, really, really goddamn big. And they kill people. They legit kill people. Don't go hiking in the springtime or the summertime alone. It's a bad plan. Those things will drag you up a tree and disembowel you and just leave you there like the predator. Uh. Go get it, Peaches! Our character is officially tweaking. Oh no. Oh shit! Get him, Peaches! I was more worried about the moose than I was the wolf. Alright, well that's gonna be the end of our stream for today. Uh, we got the kitty. We accomplished what we came to accomplish here. I'll be back playing the same game tomorrow. So if you wanted to stop on in, my name is Flattercat. I play variety games here on Twitch TV every single day. At 3 o'clock Pacific Daylight Time, on Fridays it's 2 o'clock, and on Sunday it's 2 o'clock. Sundays are kind of my floater days, sometimes I stream, sometimes I don't. But anyways, if you wanted to come hang out, I'll be live five days a week, and I would love to have you again in the future. So, don't hesitate, give that follow button a whack up top if you wanted to get some notifications about when I'll be live. And there's another, like, Puma thing coming at me. Uh, you'll get notifications whenever I go live, I promise you, it'll be a real good time, and I'd love to have you. Other than that, if you wanted to get notifications and you wanted to know what my schedule was day by day, go down to Twitter right there. That's where I post my schedule for the week uh, every single Sunday. So I'll be posting that tonight so that you know what I'm playing for the rest of the week. I will see you all later. Thank you for stopping on in. Thank you for your support. Uh, thank you for all the subs and the biddies and the tips and everything else. You guys have been absolutely fantastic today. And I'm looking forward to hanging out tomorrow, all right? I will see you all then. Uh, go get some rest and we'll meet back up at 3 o'clock tomorrow. How you do, everybody?